Do y'all remember the first girl y'all kissed? Um, kind of not really. Nah, not really. The first girl y'all had sex with? Yeah. Yes. You? The first girl. In- yeah, I do. Both? No, I don't remember the first girl I kissed. Yeah. It's that many, huh? Damn, we're a bunch of whores. <laughs> I was kissing <laughs> that, that, that many was, tongues Maul's, ago. Malls only I'll, fucks thousands of women. Rory. <laughs> <laughs> I was only kissing in like the first grade. So, you know, can't remember back then. You hit thousands? No, I don't. Li- thousands you, would be fucking. Why are you that's a lot. Why are you listening to Rory? Thousands of women. Thousands? I've thousands slept with thousands of women. A thousand is a lot. Thousands <laughs> is least crazy. Oh, he, Look he me in my eyes and tell me you think it's a lot. I don't know, man. You were moving around. No, no, you definitely won stack. Joe, <laughs> I've not slept with thousands. He got a stack. No, you, you, I don't have a stack. No, you 1K. I'm not 1K. <laughs> you are more no, 1K. Now you verify. Don't play with me like that. Buddy. What? I'm not more 1K. More right, 1K. Is it okay if I think that? No, it's not. I'm trying, I'm just, this is me telling you, like, no, it's not okay that you think that. No. There's a lot of cheers for you in the crowd from the oh lady folk. God. I don't know. Okay, he's an eight. What you, what you expect? <laughs> you don't get to be an eight yeah. by 900. No, not at all. Your That's it. I got to hit the stack. Yeah, you got to hit the stack. No. Get the eight number. Yeah, you were like a six no, five before. No, Miss Parks. Miss Parks. What's that? Six five. Uh, six the, <laughs> what episode is this? Uh, 279. 280. 279. See why we need Savon. 279, bro. Episode 279. Welcome to episode 279 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I am your humble, grateful, gracious, and highly favored nope, host. Wrong. It's 280. Hey. Oh, thank you. Whoa. Welcome to episode 280 of the Joe Budden Podcast. 281. All right. <laughs> Wait, are you all right? Rewind this shit. No, it's 280, man. <laughs> it's 280, man. Thank My you. bad. If we're off by two, we got to start over. Yeah, no, it's 280. It's 280. <laughs> It's 280, Come on, man. Come on, bro. I'm, I'm waiting for you guys it's to get out of here. I, hate, ahead, I told man. you. I, I always tell you, I hate when y'all two start clicking. What you mean? It's 280. <laughs> Welcome to episode 280 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I am your humble, gracious, grateful, and highly favored host, Joe Budden. Here with a few of my nearest and dearest friends. Maul is here. Maul here. 1K. No. Maul Mar- 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 1000. Yes. I'm not Maul 1000. Huh? No. No, huh? Nothing. <laughs> one one stack. I'm not one stack. You are one no, stack. No, I'm not, man. No, nah, you laid the stack down. No, easy. I have not laid the stack down. <laughs> easy. Yo, first, don't, easy. No, don't do that. You're not going to tell me I laid this a stack year. down. Some light. <laughs> Parks. Yo, you're this famous year. now, bro. Nah, no, but, but you're nah, a sex but, symbol. Yeah, no, you are. I am not. Yes, you are. I know I'm not. We be in the meet and greet, too. Yeah. <laughs> oh my We're God. sitting next to you. <laughs> I record them. That's I have, true. I have not slept with a stack. But you are a sex symbol. No, I'm not. It's not you. You don't determine it. Yes, you do. <laughs> no, yeah, you, you don't. don't. You don't get a say in whether you're sex symbol. You or always not. have a. You always have a say, Joe. Yeah, no, man. I'm telling you, you are. All right, Maul One Stack is here. Uh, <laughs> Parks is here. Rory is here. Uh, Erickson is here. Savon is not here. Screen Man over there. He's over there. Screen Man is here. And Screen Man is here. Rem's doing timestamps today. Hey, Rem is here. <laughs> Yeah, I figured she would be here after that girlfriend rant we went on. Like, yeah, last, last you know, she's gonna keep a close she eye said on me. She said to tighten up the shit. Yeah, uh, gentlemen, how are you feeling? How's everybody doing? What's going on? How's your mental health? How's life? Good. How's your family? Everybody's good. How, good. How's your pets? Pets, pets are, good. are good. Have the phone calls been this week? Any high stressful, high stressful phone calls? Nah. No Close maintenance. People just want yeah. to talk about things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A couple, couple meetings about the meeting, but you know, uh, I'm hanging in there. Gross. Yeah. Anybody call in with a favor? Needing a favor this week? Uh, uh, that that no. Yeah. Or no. did they do the new age favor? Anybody call in and just tell you how they're where at they're at in life? Yeah, yeah. 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 That, that is the new age. That is <laughs> the my ear is the favor. They break down the whole situation <laughs> for you. Yeah. They want you to be like, yo, yeah, I'll do that for you. Yeah, yeah. None of that. Uh, no. no, I got some of that today, actually. I didn't, cool. answer, I didn't answer my it's phone That's something I wanted to do. So. I, didn't, I didn't answer my phone a lot this week. I avoided that. I've some been doing that here. a lot, though. The phone off day. It's yeah. important. Yeah. I don't answer my phone, period. Well, me either. <laughs> but. Well, well, I think it's different. Rory's generation, they'd be surprised that you can call people with I'm, the phone. No, I'd be shocked. <laughs> why, like, mom, why are you calling me? Text me. <laughs> How oh, long yeah. do you talk that to your mom, Rory? Uh, every day. Okay. Not near once a week. Mom. Once a week. My mom doesn't like to use the phone. Uh, probably four times a week. Yeah, I spoke to my mom like four. Not every day, every other, other I'm, day. I'm going to learn about you guys today. Yeah, every other day. I'm going to ask, ask questions. Well, what about you, Jim? Slow news Saturday. Every day. Several every, times a day. Every day. Early in the morning. If it ain't the morning, then yeah, got to be the morning. Yeah, my yeah, parents don't really day. like to talk on the phone, so I'm fortunate because I don't like talking on the phone either. Yeah, my mom would text me almost every day. We talk on the phone like every other day. 
Okay, I like it like that. Dads, 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 oh, dads. About, about the same clip. My dad actually likes talking on the phone, but we text a lot. Yeah. All my family, we Maybe, text. Yeah, me, me and my pops don't talk much. We text. Yeah. See something cool I like, I text it to him. Yeah. Same. Yeah. Just getting we got like one of the, you know, a man relationship. Yeah. It's close you don't to need the, to talk on the phone like it's that. It's closer That's to true. the playoffs and off baseball, so. You don't have dad. to cover up here, Rory. <laughs> is this see, a safe place? See, see, look. You don't have to cover up. <laughs> Ain't gonna tell a man you don't have to cover up. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to cover up here, bro. You can let it out. What for you, real, Roy? And, and if see, you cry, we won't judge you. Okay, see, this, is, you this is why niggas don't share shit, man. <laughs> what y'all y'all, y'all didn't hear to share. No, I'm just saying y'all didn't hear that nigga shit that Rory just did. But like, yeah, we have a man relationship. A man yeah, relationship. Yeah, yeah. come on, Rory. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Irish man relationship. We don't have to talk you on the phone. Type relationship. Huh? If you try to hug your dad, he'll look at you like you're crazy. You don't, you don't see he throwing in qualifications that we might not get. <laughs> <laughs> this is a thing happening here. Yeah, no, <laughs> Irish people, we we don't share our emotions with each other. No, that's true. Yeah, y'all not, just, y'all just fight each other and, and have not a, a beer. Thing. Yeah, we just let it like you know boil up and then die. Yeah, yeah. Uh, me and my father, we sit on the porch and drink a whiskey. Yeah, it's bonding. Yeah. If you weren't Irish, do you think you, there'd be some things for you guys to share with each other? <laughs> if you weren't Irish, <laughs> no, we share things with yeah, each maybe, other. Maybe Cody. Me, yeah, and, my dad, me and my dad are really close. But it's just how we operate yeah. as men. Maul, uh, I speak to my dad probably twice a week. Yeah, it's getting closer to playoff time, baseball. So we're probably gonna speak every. Oh, he's a big baseball fan. Yeah. Oh, is that how you guys connect? Yeah. Okay. How does he feel about the upside down Yankee? MG, you think that's disrespect? <laughs> nah, he, 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 anything Yankee, he don't care. Sideways, upside down, he don't care. Okay. Do you wish there were more ways that you guys connected? Do I wish there were more ways? Oh, we, we connect, but we just speak more now when it's like playoff time. Mm-hmm. I wish my family lived closer if I was asked the same question. I wish I could see that coming, more often. I was coming to you. Yeah. Yeah, he just jumped in with some. All right, I like that. He's yeah. sharing. I'm sharing. No, I like that. I like yeah. where we're at this podcast. Uh, yeah. what, about, what about you and your father? No, nah, I speak to my dad every day, too. I see your pop stand there every day. Yeah, but you and, your, you and your dad hustle together. So don't do that. Don't do that. That's, yeah, yeah, nah, that's true. Y'all hustle together. I, I, shit, do, I wish uh, me and my pops could find a game yeah, where we right? go, go uptown and yeah, crack me, niggas for a quick 800. Me, yeah. me and my dad would kill the yeah. trouble board. Yeah. Yeah. Like, me, me and pops don't play. <laughs> shoots and ladders, yeah. him and I. I wish my pops knew how to play 2K. We'd be uptown all day getting this money. You guys as dads know how to play card games. This, my pops knows how to play backgammon. That was his shit in that era. They played backgammon a lot. Backgammon? Yeah. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> backgammon. Yeah. The game That's the back. one with the. the no, I, don't I know what it is. Yeah. I just I don't know, don't know how, to how to play it. I don't know how to play that game. You just move all the little pieces to the other side. It's a pretty fun game. That sounds like every board. Game. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It so, is. You just move so all you, the pieces a piece and there's a board. <laughs> now nah, pick the piece and then you just move it around the board. Like, fam, that sounds like Monopoly. That it sounds is. like it's everything. everything. Yeah. Uh, well, but before we continue, I want to wish each and every one of you guys a happy one year anniversary. Let me hit the round of applause. Yes. You guys are awesome. Pop the champagne it's cause of you guys you're, man. you're awesome too Joe Boop. You guys make Don't it sell on. yourself short <laughs> Make it thank, a very thank, A thank very healthy work environment Here at Parks I it appreciate is. that yeah, You're welcome Thank yeah, you Yeah uh, man Yeah I got a fucking Toast to toast Parks man Who has to clean up Behind us <laughs> twice a week <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Whose carpet Has to deal with me Spilling shit all the time It's okay It gives it character <laughs> It does yeah, no, I mean, Parks, be, Parks used to be pissed. He's off gonna make some here. money off this carpet and this. <laughs> I'm gonna sell this the carpet, shit, like, yeah. yo, man, this couch, lemonade. <laughs> no, I want to cut. <laughs> no, I, I, I do believe that if you put this carpet up on eBay, that it would sell. Somebody would it buy would be it. auction. Yeah, absolutely. I'm gonna do that. I need a new carpet. Anyway. I'm gonna buy this shit. <laughs> Well, yeah. What's the bottom line? Get a rug cleaner first. No, no, that's driving <laughs> yeah, the price yeah, up yeah. like Balenciaga on the jean jacket. Oh, okay. Yeah. Market. You just got to put it in the uh, basement like this, and, and you got to highlight it. Circle where I spilt all the shit at. <laughs> this is Joe's yeah. seat. Yeah, you got to <laughs> outline it like a, a, a homicide. Like mm. just put everything, tape everything. I like it. Yeah. Welcome to our family first podcast. <laughs> well, hold on, before Fram- family friendly. Before you start, I have a little discrepancy since we're a year in. We shouldn't hold things in. Uh, I feel like Maul has shared. His merch, tough crowd with people. I've shared EO stuff. Parks has shared Gangstar stuff. All of us are still buttonless. That is true. I have no button sweatsuit. Yeah. Can you zoom in on that? Can you can you get I want a bearded man on my hoodie too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess. I'll take a bearded yeah, I guess. I'll, take, I'll take a bearded man hoodie too, Joe. That was hurtful. Uh, what? That I'll take a bearded man hoodie? No, the yeah, I guess. Oh, I'm sorry. It looks like a nice fabric. It looks comfortable. That's I like, like the way, I like great, the way it's cut. That's a great airport. My uh, friends, I don't think are as supportive of me as I am of them. No, we're what? supportive. 
No, just that was us supporting. Oh, come on. Yeah, like when Maul came in with the tough crowd shit. This before I knew it was fire. I was like, oh yeah, man, it's dope. Nah, good looking, man. Hope your peoples do well and succeed. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna wear this shit. Like, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> would anyone believe you would ever say those words <laughs> ever? <laughs> succeed. Yeah. Succeed. <laughs> Joe, has Joe has never, never said he has succeed. Never in told his life. a nigga, I hope you succeed. <laughs> I do hope people succeed. You have never no, told a man you hope he succeeds. Or a woman. Yeah, well, definitely not a woman. Maybe in the podcast well, yeah, talk. He's yeah. definitely told a woman, I hope she sucks. I've told all club. the women that I hope they succeed. <laughs> yeah, you, you definitely told women you hope they succeed. Then the ones I really like, I tell them, you're going to succeed. Why, you give them the startup money? Yeah, and then I help them succeed, and they bounce. <laughs> <laughs> That's the brand. That's the wave right there. Oh, oh that's, that's the, horrible. That's the, the brand. button brand. That's, that's the, the button yeah. brand. That's the button way. That's the button way. Yo, y'all hurting that's me. That's in your mission statement <laughs> on the company website. Get the cheese and go. <laughs> Put some scandalous shit about me in the news and <laughs> embarrass me on TV. This fucking no, well, yeah, no. Would you happen to know a Spanish woman from the uh, uptown area? <laughs> from the uptown area. Looking for an investor? <laughs> oh, shit, man. Holy shit. <laughs> looking for. <laughs> They're all looking for investors, by the way. They are. <laughs> Great record. This is definitely the theme song. 100%. <laughs> This was my hey. shit. I ain't gonna lie. Come on, shout out your your, your I, I co-star. played it. I played it to be funny as and have it as like a music bed for you guys' uh Spanish girl button jokes, but <laughs> now it's hard. Yeah, it's hard. Oh, you gotta play uptown vibes. More was A and R and even back out. then. You know what I'm saying? You're an artist. Was it one? you? No. Was it you that said you was in this video? Or was that another one of my friends? <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Somebody told me they was in this video. I can I see Maul in this video. Me too. No. Not in this. You, yeah, me too. Not in this video, Rory. <laughs> you I think sure? you are. I'm, I think you're it was hard. you that I'm told just, me that. No. What not. videos are you in? None. Really? You're right. No, you was in backstage. <laughs> no, I was not, man. <laughs> All right, but you was backstage. He was definitely in Young Guns, you Can't Stop, Won't Stop. No. He was running around the all girls college. You was the third. I wish. You was the third Young Gun. Young Maul. Okay, I see what Joe's about to say. Was the third young guy. I was the younger gun. That's, right. That's where you got the first 200 or so. No, you was Top Gun. You was, the, you was the Top Gun. No, I was not the Top Gun, Joe. You were. You were a little kid freestyling backstage next to Beans. Oh, you, 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 you <laughs> That was you. You was a kid eating the cereal? <laughs> Remember that? Remember that? Remember what every nigga thought? <laughs> Yo, you know that was that was me. I was eating. Yeah, no, eating he was. Your cereal. album is trash. Shut the fuck he up. was eating cereal, but your album's trash, bro. <laughs> Where would you find gentlemen luck like to start on this uh, wonderful Saturday morning? Um, I don't know. Antonio Brown update. If I never hear the name Antonio For Brown, real? I tried to tell you it's not gonna work. What about AB? No, it's gonna work. Hell, no, it's not. I don't want to hear AB either. Okay. I'd rather not start with Antonio Brown. Yeah, it's okay. Little... We're not gonna start here. <laughs> That's a damper. Oh, let's start with Alexis. She got her car back. Hey, and, and everyone in New Jersey is able to get gas again. <laughs> right. Thank God. Peacefully. There's justice. The and street, gas. You know, the streets, and gas. I went to the vet today. There was no one on the highway. Yeah, <laughs> the streets was clear. Yeah, no one could get gas. Got to thank Alexis. All right, let's That's see. a good look. Let me. That's, a good look, Let me start this thing That's a good look for gas. Is it a good look for gas? It's a good look for gas. All right, come on. I was trying to produce you guys, and like <laughs> as usual, you guys joked right through it. But let's harken back to our one-year anniversary on Spotify. Our five-year anniversary is coming up in February, and we'll deal with oh, that. We'll cross I mean, that bridge when we get there. A year. Wow. Wow. Where do I begin? <laughs> come on, Mo. It went Hark. by really fast. Hark. I'll say that. I'll start it there. It did. did. It, did. It, did. it did go by really fast. It feels like I it was, realized that today. Like a week. Oh, fuck. I'm so mad that y'all gave Mo where to begin. <laughs> that's, that's where I was going to begin. Like, right. It did go by fast. Um, but it was fun. I think I think we didn't have time to really sit back and think about what we were doing. Yeah, we have no days off. So. Yeah. But I think when you know you take a minute and look Eve. back, what we were able to do in the year, the people we've met, places we've been, going on tour. I think it was, it was dope, man. I had a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to another year. Why do you? Why are you I didn't think a podcast it past would, tense. Would take it this far. Awesome. <laughs> well, no, because the year is behind us. So now we have to we moving forward to a new year. I got it. Go but ahead. I'm saying that 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 the year that we had was it was historical. I think I think when 20 years from now, when we look back, we'll really understand exactly how dope what we did this year was and and how important it was to the culture of podcasting. Because I think that this, what we did this year, especially with our live shows and going on tour, that was unheard of. 
Like we were in venues And people didn't even know What a podcast was That worked there That's a fact If I'm not, yeah. here, if I'm not here in 20 years I don't want you to be in charge Of the Joe Budden uh, Podcast Remembrance Day <laughs> <laughs> We'll you, make a festival no, I want you to organize Yeah let's it. make a festival We'll, we'll take your ashes We'll oh, smoke awesome. you like Canaan and uh, <laughs> Ashes on the roof We'll smoke you in every city <laughs> hey, Let me just interrupt It's a lot of ashes in, 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 <laughs> I'll interrupt our little one year soliloquy to, to say I went and picked up my dog's ashes because that's supposed to be like the right thing to do. Did you spoke like, up? Supposed, Brooklyn? Supposed, yeah, it's supposed mm-hmm. to be like, you know, you're still here with me. Yeah. It's just sad still. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like seeing that, nah, seeing I don't think that's me happy. Yeah, yeah, no. How big is a box for a dog? Cause like, nah, Brooklyn is mad heavy, so the, yeah. the dust so is like, heavy still. Oh, okay. like, like, yeah. I was shocked when I held my uncle in the box. It was like this big. It was like, yeah, that's a whole person. Yeah. See, I thought the opposite. I looked at it you're like, that's not Brooklyn. <laughs> well, I said, too much. Put a in there. Like, yeah. I said the same thing when they had Kanan in the bag on the roof. I was like, that's not Kanan. <laughs> Kanan would be fit. You know, Kanan had some size to him. He wasn't. Yeah. yeah. Parks, your turn. You, you, you <laughs> walk, us, walk us through the year. Uh, shit, man. It's really weird that my apartment is uh, being ripped off on other podcasts. And, uh, that's dope. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, man. <laughs> I, think, I, think, uh, I think Parks really covered it. <laughs> what I was gonna say with the hey man, yeah, he said he said so much, he said so much. Hey man, yeah, we, uh, these guys th- get paid to explain things. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think I think it was great uh, for as disruptive as all of us have been. Period. That we were able to do this with a company for this long. Yeah, my neighbors hate us. I don't know if all of I'm us just have joking. been so disruptive, but yeah, no. <laughs> well, just go ahead. <laughs> um, I, I have to shout out Spotify. I can't believe we we did a year. Yeah, I gotta shout out my neighbors. Them as well. <laughs> fuck your neighbors. Nah, they cool. Why fuck the neighbors? I don't know. They don't ever so complain. Neighbors. We loud. Yeah, Joe yelling and shit. We don't be that loud in here though, do we? Joe, nah, Joe's, Joe's pretty Joe. loud. It's early. <laughs> as long as the news didn't go off yet, you can be loud. That's true. Yeah. But yeah, it was a fun year, man. It was a, it was a really fun year. I had a lot of fun. Yeah, and I think to Maul's point, I, I think it was great for podcasting that we could put somewhat of a number to some degree what podcasts are worth. Certainly not the max, but at least the starting point, I don't think there was really what podcasts were worth in a deal like this. So I think it was a good point for other podcasts to look at and say, hey, all right, now mm-hmm. we kind of see what maybe we should be thinking we're worth, even though we're worth more. But that's neither here nor there. I think it was a great, great starting year. Glad we toured for so long. Glad y'all, we got to meet our fans. Y'all a celebratory chance to, a chance to send some shots out here, huh? <laughs> yeah. The no, I, I, I it's called crazy. celebrate. Blah, blah. Hate celebrate. Ooh. <laughs> I've been working, nigga. You see my shit. <laughs> <laughs> I've been working on mine, nigga. Yo, pop that fucking shit. Pop that fucking shit. Wasn't sure if Joe had more from... Uh, Oh, all right. Hey, More for the rug. Hey, all right. It's a party now. The rug I'll make sure love. I circle that spot. One year. Rug <laughs> needed some love. Maul, are you drinking with us? For those of you just listening, uh, Rory just popped champagne. Shout out to Ron Browse. I was hoping you were going to play that instead. <laughs> still, hey. still hasn't gotten a paper towel. <laughs> what did you say? Savon oh. still hasn't got a paper towel. I got it. I got it. I got Covered it. in I got champagne. It. Oh, go ahead, you guys. You guys deserve it. Do you want some... Uh, you, you guys are awesome, man. Is there some virgin Ace Some space? sparkling oh, yeah. cider. <laughs> yeah, we got the Martinelli's with the bubbles. Hey! Get somebody get Joe some Asti Tumanti. <laughs> hey, yeah. <laughs> that was a favorite rap bar for a while. Asti Tumanti? It raps well, though. I do love seeing the, uh, the podcast space so, uh, so crowded. The podcast space. Yeah. Yeah. There's a podcast space yeah, no. Right and, here and it's This crowded. is the podcast space no, It's kind of crowded No it's bigger than us oh, I'm okay. not that self-centered I'm not, not going to use the chance To send shots like you and Rory did No I, <laughs> I didn't, didn't send a no shot shots. at all um, I said no shot. thought it was a good thing I was thankful and gracious Yeah um, I'm really happy That the space is crowded I'm really happy that There is a clear Today I was talking about that With um Might have been my mom I don't remember Corey I don't remember But today there's a clear path to a lot of things that were invisible or unavailable to us. Uh, I'll try to remix my shit to make it sound and, nicer and not a shot. You're sending a shot. How's that a shot? You just said it nicer. No, no, I'm, 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 saying, I'm saying there's a clear path now. There's a clear passageway to achieve some things. And I can recognize that other people recognize that. And it, it, may, it gives me pride and joy uh, to see people, to see people 
Uh, just do it. Man, talk your shit. You went to look for Rolls Royce the other week. I test drove that thing. Yeah. That thing is all right. Let's get a little toast. You're huh? going to hate it in four months. <laughs> Somebody toast. else said that. I'm telling you. To one year and to, to many more. Maul. Oh, shut up, Maul. I promise. Wait, we didn't even, we didn't even say anything. Peace. I said I promise. No, I'm talking about to toast. <laughs> I said oh. to one year and to many more, but. Yeah, hey, go ahead. one year and many more. Come on, here we go. One year down, many more to go. I tell you, it's because of you guys. You, you're the important guys in the room. You guys, man. <laughs> Ooh, that's that good. Woohoo! It's it is actually good because it's good warm. Yeah. Okay, what were we saying now? We're saying we're the best. Oh my god, no, we're enough. Of that. <laughs> uh, no, we were talking about, we were talking uh, about podcast how, how people are are spending their one year money. Oh wait, Ro- uh, Maul was telling me. Maul was telling me. Uh, why am I gonna hate the Ro- Rolls Royce truck? Is you just gonna hate it? Oh, you want the truck? Yeah, I'm gonna get the truck. Oh. Oh yeah, you definitely. Hate yeah, it. that's silly. Definitely. Why? Why? why don't you get like a sweet fast car? I'm gonna put. I'm going to put you on the phone with somebody that has it and just let you talk to them. You get a sensible Prius that you can just drive around. <laughs> a Prius. Be on your Larry real David sensible shit for car. real, for real. Why don't you guys get cars? I'm getting one. Uh, I think about it, but then I don't. I can't really justify spending the money on a car. I don't drive. I uh, I add up the amount of miles I drive in a year, and it's like, it would be crazy. I got a balcony I, instead. I think about it. A what? What you said? I was going to get a car, but I got a balcony instead. A oh, balcony? that's nice. Balcony is worth more than a car. I like yeah. the balcony. Yeah. I'll spend way more time on a balcony <laughs> than I will in a car. For sure. 100%. Or I'll get the balcony but, and the car. But you know Joe got Joe got it all. I've been itching to buy a car, though. But I just can't really justify spending you know $700 a month plus on a car that I drive once a month. I added up my you Uber. You should get a smart car. It, it was a no. car payment. I'm six foot five. It's all right. <laughs> I saw Shaq getting a smart car the other day. You can do it. Oh, yeah? yeah. He got paid to do that. You get Probably. paid to do yeah, it, if too? They, if they pay me. <laughs> I'll have a smart car. You'll get in one? Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. I've been thinking about getting like an old car though. Like a uh like an older Porsche or Mercedes or something and, like that. And I'm the hipster. That's always fun. No, I'm a hipster. I'm cool with that. <laughs> that's fun. Because I don't brand. ever drive but it. But that's on brand with parts. Yeah, no doubt. God, we don't, care. Brand we don't care this much. <laughs> about with parts. This is too much. <laughs> <laughs> you niggas can't never say some shit in passing. <laughs> uh come on, what 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 are we leading to with this what one person has been spending their what are you saying over here? Well, there's, there's, there's been uh, there's been rumors. <laughs> Streets have been talking a little bit, mm. just about how someone on this podcast spends some of their I'm here their, to, their I, Spotify I'm money. I'm here. I'm here this week to refute the things that Maul hears from his friends in the streets. Nah, not necessarily my friends. Just people in passing. Associates. They know that we know each other, so you know. How do they know that? Oh, okay. <laughs> they don't know that we know just each other. Pod, yeah, I know. Yeah, you're right. Two times a week. You're right. You're absolutely right. And I, I don't. You can't. You can't listen to things that you hear in the streets from people. Oh, the yeah, streets don't can. really lie, though. Yeah, that's a fact. No, but some of the things I already knew from you. Maul, uh, me and Maul continue to have this tricking conversation. <laughs> and a great conversation, by the way. And I think Maul just don't know what the fuck he be talking about when it comes to tricking. That's number what tricks one. usually say. And number two, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to figure out why Maul is not more supportive of the tricking community. <laughs> What? I don't. I don't not support. No, you're not as supportive as I would think that you are. Like, well, what, what, okay, so what makes you say I'm not supportive? What makes me say you're not supportive? Yeah, like, what have I said that wasn't in support of? Uh, you you kind of just shit on everyone that gives no, I don't. women money. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah. You can't find me shit on nobody and that's that, ever given. And, I say I don't do it. I just yeah. say it's nothing wrong with it. Yeah, I just you, don't do it. You just and then you shit on the idea of how anyone could do that. No, 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 I, no, no. Don't do that. What I do is when you try to say it's not tricking, I shit on that, and I say no, it is tricking because it is in fact tricking because it is tricking. I don't if I don't care who tricks and I don't give a fuck about that. But I, don't try to say it's not true. I think I think that there are some variables that you just leave out. Okay, like, what like, you, I, like I would you just, got it. I would like a real definition from Maul. Yes. Of what tricking is? Yes. When you're paying for a woman's time because you know you would not be able to get her time if it, if you weren't paying for it. Oh, Joe could probably get her time. I was going to say. She I, probably listens I, to the I've, podcast. I've given, I, I, I've given money to, whoa, whoa, to whoa, women whoa, whoa, that would whoa, already whoa. have my I'm time. I'm on record saying that, <laughs> which is why I don't understand why he would. Because you can get the time even if you didn't. Well, he's a, he's a charitable person. That's, that's what it. tricks tax you right I was about to say taxes. Yeah, it, it, it expedites things sometimes. That's important. Uh, it can avo- skip some steps. It, yeah, it uh, it avoids some some hassle. Uh, it avoids some of those conversations about like 
you know, having to hear about her, like her coworker that she doesn't like, and you know, all that <laughs> stuff that guys have to normally do. Mm, okay, just yeah. avoid some of those things. So tricking is to, you don't want to have too much conversation. You want to get right to the the treats. Well, well, with specific women that you may not want to have a conversation with. Mm. Okay. One day, Lonnie Blair was doing a Q and A on Instagram, so I asked her. In regards to this conversation, I said, "Is it tricking if you've got it?" She said, "No, it's it's not tricking if you got it." So, Joe, no, do, do you it's have still it? Tricking. What did you think she was supposed to say? Well, I don't know. Oh, okay, I think there needs to be a dollar amount. To there needs to be a threshold, a, per- a percentage. Yeah, because like you make a lot more than you know someone That's else. And, and, and an activity kind of clause on there too. Yeah, because if you're getting a great ROI, <laughs> <laughs> it's an investment thing. Then it goes a little different, Ma. I think you just ignore some of that that shit. No, I speak, think it's, speak to it. I please. think it's all tricking, no matter how broke or if you poor spend five hundred dollars uh, on a girl, it's tricking. Depending on how she looks, right? No, it depends <laughs> on what I spent the five hundred on. Like if, it, if 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 we went to her, dinner, her hair and nails, and that's not my girl. Yeah, then yeah, that's tricking. But what if she returned Wait, the what? favor and uh, it's still tricking. <laughs> It's still it doesn't the dollar it's amount crazy. doesn't make it tricking. That's what y'all not understand. So her being there are nigga that there are dudes that are dead broke who will take their last. So why would they and be, hand it to a woman just for some attention? At no point could that's that, still tricking. Can that not be a kind gesture? A kind gesture. What You're a, a trick. What if it's the holiday season? <laughs> Hair and nails is a trick. Yes, Come on. I can guarantee you that's exactly what she refers to you as a trick. But dinner is not a trick. It can be. It can oh. be taken as that. It can okay. be taken as tricking. Well, humans yes. need to. But well, you don't ever see like online when they be like, "Yo, you're in his, you're in his phone as food and and nails or hair." Like Yo, the more and more. That's what if, tricking. What, all right. What if I'm not? What if the more, I, more I just would like to you. give her money for her nails? Then yeah, what I if would, her nails are fucked up? Yeah. Then you're, you're a trick. What if I you're like not, her? You gonna run around and just fix everyone's? What if? Hair? What if I like her? You're a fucking trick. I don't know how y'all want me to slice this pie. You're a trick. It's nothing wrong Even with it. Even if I like her, you're just a. Tr- no, you're no, still a trick. I, I want to know what. I don't you care. So if you're you a like trick her all the way up until you marry her. You're a trick if you're giving a woman money. What are you for her time and attention? <laughs> I don't trick. No, no, I know. I don't trick. I know, but I, I'm. I clear. don't trick. I know. I understand that yeah. part. But what are but you? But again, it's, it's, nothing, it's, it's nothing wrong with it. I, I'm not saying it's. Right I'm not there, saying there's so. anything wrong with tricking. I'm just saying that you can't try to make it or justify it and say, "Oh, it's not tricking because I didn't spend three thousand. I spent." 1500 Okay hold no, on No you're hold still on. a trick I want to use your definition I want to use your definition <laughs> That's what again. tricks usually call me Your definition <laughs> was You're paying for her time That you would not get otherwise If you did not pay Correct? Yeah you're paying for her time What if she's giving me her time And I want to get her nails done? You're still a trick uh, Rory I don't understand But she still it's... would be here Yeah but you're still a trick She's only there because she's No she's getting something of No she's, I'm saying she's still going to be here No matter all right, what Alright so alright all wait wait all right, That's where I see Alright wait a minute I see what you're trying to say what if she's not only there because that's, you're that's getting what her getting hair at. and her nails and her feet done? Yeah, what if she that's likes my, you? That's, that's my personality. Question. But then that sounds like some. But you can still you can still trick on somebody you're dating. Yeah, see, I All think right. y'all getting it wrong when I say tricking. <laughs> it's not a negative thing. I'm just saying, don't try to justify it and say it's not tricking because Maul, I only. Spent but this by your wait, definition, wait, wait. that doesn't make sense because she'd be here regardless. We're, and Maul, we're no. No, we don't think it's negative, so we're not trying to justify it. <laughs> yeah, but just yeah, but the way you're saying it is like I'm trying to make it seem like it's a negative, and I'm not. I'm just saying it's tricking. That's all. I think that you trick. No, we <laughs> can think that, but you're not gonna. You by, can't. By your own definition, you you would have to. Is buying bottles tricking? Is buying bottles tricking? Is buying yeah. weed tricking? <laughs> Anytime you're entertaining a woman and you know she wouldn't entertain you unless you were doing something for her, that's considered tricking. They always want you to do something for them. Uh, yeah. But <laughs> what they always want and what you do are two totally different things. That's all I'm saying. So that anytime I, you know, I can guarantee you that a lot pocket. of these women... And, and the thing is, it's not like a, a big secret. Like, women have dudes in their phone, and they know what they can hit this dude for, this dude. They have dudes for different What's things. We know that. We're aware of that. Yeah, so that's all I'm saying. It's just You're, you're not you're, tricking the guy with the $50 million contract out of five grand. Yes, you are. <laughs> it's, it's not a trick. Yes, you are. You're not affecting it's, like, it's, it's like giving Shorty a piece of gum. Yes, yeah, you are. I don't no, understand but see, it doesn't, because, because you have it, because you have money doesn't mean Davis. you're not tricking. You're tricking. It doesn't just because you have money and you spend it don't, doesn't mean oh he got fifty million dollars like so if he spends ten on a girl that wasn't tricking no yes it was if I go in Chanel and buy a girl a bag and I, I'm still tricking on her but it's nothing wrong with it but you have to call it what it is you're tricking you're spending money on her you're doing I would this, doing just that. like to know how your dating life 
Because <laughs> dating what, in what, general what, is tricky. Dating yes. would be tricky. Dating, dating is different because that's your girl. That's no, the it's not your girl. girl. You, you just told us you, if you were dating you're, her, you could still no, trick her. No, you're dating. Dating, not not you're with her. You're dating. Oh, you're talking about like multiple women. You're no, dating, just, just attempting dating. an attempt to get to know someone. Like just going out to eat or whatever you call a date. Oh, yeah, you can still trick on a date, yeah. Absolutely. Well, no, according to you, Mom, the entire date is a trick. A, it's a common courtesy. Shut the fuck no, up. No, it's not a common courtesy. <laughs> Joe, listen, you're, you're, it's a rhetoric. trick. You're a trick. If you go on a date, well, no, I agree. Joe's a, a trick. Joe's a trick. No, no, but Joe is a trick. How you getting mad at me calling it? It's common. It's not common courtesy. That not, sounds like Mom, we're trick not, language. We're not arguing if I'm a trick. We're arguing what you think a trick is. <laughs> a trick is somebody that spends money on a woman and entertains a woman knowing that she would not be there or giving her her time, giving him her time if he wasn't spending money on her. That's a trick let me tell the audience g- gentlemen if you take a young lady out to dinner and you pay for the check you are not a trick i didn't say that was a trick though <laughs> See, i never said especially that. not if you got it. i never said that though if you valet I never the car if you valet the car i never said, said if you take a trick to you a trick are not dinner, a, trick. It's a trick i never if said that go to the i said if you're spending it, money on her knowing that she would not be giving you any time or attention if you were not spending money on her you're tricking like if you go and shopping like oh, i'm gonna get her this get her that i'm gonna get her nails and her hair done but by that definition every girl in the world would leave God, all of God us if we didn't spend no money Uber Uber driver. <laughs> and I was about, by that definition <laughs> I can't be a trick because I think the chicks would spend time with me anyway so but by that's that the definition point you just I said, couldn't be but a trick you just, said, you just said you trick because it expedites things so you just agreed that the reason why you trick no, you know you don't no, have to I opened you up to some other reasons why tricking may be happening he's just trying to put you on who me and save yeah. you some time no. that's it my, my time is saved I'm good I want to know. I want to know what Maul spends a dollar on when it comes to women. Women cones. That's what I'm asking. Definitely cones. It depends. I mean, I do. I do dinners. Let's further this conversation past our, our both of our respective stances. <laughs> yeah, I do dinners, but that's kind of like I Is mean, I'm, I'm eating too, so it doesn't really. Is that it? Are you trick yeah. it on yourself? Can you trick on yourself? Maul, trick not, on yourself. Yeah, here, so Maul, you're not sitting here saying you've only ever paid for a dinner. What, I mean, uh, as far as if it's a woman I'm dating, yeah. then I, it, I, I could, I'll pay for whatever. It's that, that's my girl or the woman I'm dating. That's different. Well, this is a woman that I'm seeing, that I'm with. Like, that's yeah, but different. dating, I don't, I don't mean exclusively. I mean just dating, attempting to get to know. Oh, if I'm spending money on a woman, then it's more likely she's somebody that I know or like we know each other on that level already. So, like, I don't just spend money on. Are flights tricking? Who flights? Are flights tricking? Yeah. You know, if it's a woman that you're serious with or you know like that, no. But what if it's you, not, you can what spend if I, money on a woman if you I'm want not that girl you can't spend there. money on a woman like I'm not saying that what if like you're going to LA and she lives in Houston and you wanted her to maybe come spend some time with you in LA no that's that's not tricking that's that's oh, okay. a woman that you're you're seeing that you're okay you know. what if what if you're not seeing her what if you just want to fly her to the city you're in oh yeah that's tricking because I want her company <laughs> when you want to lap dance what you do fam she's <laughs> staying with me. I'm just saying, but when you want to laugh, when you, when you, when you want to, yeah, she, and, 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 and a stripper stay with you too all night, but guess what you got to do at the end of the night? I'm not paying the woman to stay with me you in me the hotel. You asked me a question. You asked me a question. I'm paying for her to come next to me. Right. And you're paying for a stripper to come and, and sit next to you and dance on you too, right? It's the <laughs> same not shit. not the same thing it at is. all. If I if like a woman, if I like a woman, woman that you're serious and, with, then and she's like with a bunch of other. How do I get that? serious if I can't get her next to me, Ma? <laughs> no, you, you're missing what I'm saying, though, bro. I'm talking about a woman like if you fly a girl out that you're like trying to get serious with, that's not considered tricking. Because what if I I'm have, just like, trying a, to beat? Then that's tricking, and that's fine. <laughs> but for me, in order for me to beat, without paying her to beat, I'm so sorry to the people listening. <laughs> I need to get her in my presence. You trying to listen to some drink? No, that, that's nah. not true, bro. That's not. What true. if I fly myself to her city? She didn't get a dollar. Great. Am I, did I trick? No. Then what's the difference? <laughs> We're both what next to each other now different? for the same amount of money. There, there's a lot of difference. <laughs> it's the same there, amount of money. No, it's not true. It's not true, bro. If right. I spend, listen, if I spend twenty five hundred and get ten grand worth of head. <laughs> then, then, then what the fuck are you what, is what t- the fuck is 10 grand, grand worth the head, head? Yeah. Oh, but see this is the lingo oh, that man. tricks come up with this is this is the lingo I gotta figure out what this is let me, let me jump in this and is take the lingo this combo that tricks where it needs to be so that these niggas is, can stop no, just that's what, playing do si that's what that's the lingo that tricks come up with you'll start telling yourself I gave her 2500 but the sex felt like $10,000 worth like tricks always find a way to relate it back to the money they spent or didn't spend no, no. Because that, that same head you got, somebody got that for free. Good for him. 
I'm talking <laughs> and about. That's all I'm saying. I'm, I'm talking but about you're me. the trick. I'm talking yeah. about me. Right. That's what I'm saying. But I don't. I don't <laughs> compare and contrast the way that you just did. What do you mean you don't compare and contrast? Like if I'm paying twenty five hundred for the bus down, I'm certainly not sitting here thinking about what the next guy did. I'm enjoying my twenty five hundred. No, as you should. <laughs> but I'm just saying you can't sit there. Every dollar. You can't sit there and say, "Oh my God, that yeah. was ten grand worth. I'm, I got a deal." But at this point, I'm mushing her head trying to get the ten thousand dollar head. <laughs> yeah, but that's that's still trick lingo, though, man. That's still I can't. Trick Come on, lingo. give it me is. the back yeah. mouth sauce. It is trick give lingo. Give me the back mouth sauce. Somebody, trying to get a deal out of this. Somebody yeah. got that for free, guaranteed. Come on, what does that have to do with you? What do you mean What does that have to do with See? you It just means you're a trick And the other dude isn't <laughs> That's what I'm saying It's okay to trick I mean it's a lifestyle I get no, it let's, let's advance this This tricking conversation And I'd like to more so Get into where you've you, Where you've gathered All of your thoughts <laughs> you mean, Where did all of this stuff Come from What do you mean Where did it come from Just I mean you just live life And you see how shit goes There's a word for that Jaded <laughs> Nah, I'm not jaded over no tricking or no no hoeing. I don't care about that. I'm jaded for I'm jaded for other reasons, like realer reasons. And I know the game. I know how it is for when a girl's out by her money, she hustling. I respect that. But I'm just saying we can't we can't act like it's not a term for that. There is a term for that. There's, that's a lifestyle. But being jaded is for me comes from more personal experiences. Like when you just spending money tricking, that's just like you know what it is. Right then and there, you leave that alone. You don't care about that. No are way. are you jaded? I'm jaded. Kiss. We know this. <laughs> <laughs> we know this. Top five dead or alive. Oh, <laughs> top three. You crazy. That's just off one girlfriend. Yeah, yeah of course. <laughs> I'm j- yeah, yeah. That was me. That was funny. <laughs> that was me. Yeah. So you're aware of it? Absolutely. Are you doing anything to repair it? Yeah. Such yeah. as? Um, I don't fucking all these hoes. I'm not fucking no hoes. Run, um, run no, I just I don't. Are oh, you trying to be two stacks? No. <laughs> Are you trying to get the two <laughs> before the summer's up? <laughs> the summer's up. Right? The summer's up. No, I'm just. Uh, you just don't approach. You try to forget about the past and not apply the same past experiences to new relationships. Like when you meet somebody, you give them a chance to show them who they are and experience them. Like whatever you went through was like, listen, that's in the past. You can't put that on the new person and think that oh she might be the same way or he might be the same you know what i'm saying like you got to put that shit in it's an experience like yeah i went through that i dealt with that i've seen that i know how those type of relationships can go i know how women can be like really really sneaky and this that and the third and but you can't apply that to every woman though are you guys jaded of course Definitely. <laughs> what i think I, every man is jaded I am. at some point <laughs> no <Yeah>. no <laughs> It's you? Almost, you know what though It's almost hard Not to be jaded in We just had a conversation About girls what? beating us up At our own houses Last week Like It's kind of hard For people not to be jaded in, 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 in the world today though Because we see so many Relationships On public display That you kind of Just feel like God damn Like That's You weird. see all the negative shit Like that relationships Go through It's like You start to feel like Is there any like Good people left in the world Is there any relationships That will work Well That's such a But that's such a small scope we're not, no, maybe it's, I'm just saying, but a lot. We're not all of these. No, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying that a lot of people. <laughs> no, I'm yeah. just saying no. A lot of people in today's world would feel like they see a lot of relationships on public display. You see it every True. day. Every day you open your phone. There's a couple here, a couple here, new couple, old couple broke up, baby mother fight, this, that, and third. So you start to feel like, well, damn. Like especially if you're single. Like if you have somebody that you've been with, it's kind of like, damn. I'm. We staying out of the way of that. But if you're single and you're trying to get into this dating game and meet people, you got to kind of sort of meet people with that in the back of your mind. Like, damn, man. Like, I hope she's not like this type of woman or that no, type of woman. No, you would only think that if you're jaded. But I'm saying it's hard not to yeah. have some type and of... And you'd only think that if you, like, didn't trick. Because you could just pay them to not feel that way. <laughs> See? Can you pinpoint... Uh, can you pinpoint... Uh, the events that... Turned you into Jaded Kiss, and and the women who caused them. Um, just just in, in seeing close relationships, uh, from you know people either family or close friends, seeing certain shit that they go through, certain shit that I've went through, like in dating women. That's what I'm looking. Give me um, that, that, yeah, tell, tell like me just, more. Tell just, me more about that. It's just certain shit that happens, like whether uh, you know, women lying. Or you just know women have been with a bunch of men that you didn't know, what? that you may know, you but you didn't know that. about. You niggas, I'm sick have of you. Uh, have, you been a, have you been a, a, goddamn, have you been a, abandoned in a time of need? No. 
Oh. I've, I've never been abandoned in a time of need. Have you ever been abandoned? No. Have you ever been in need? Of course. All right, but, so tell me more about how you became jaded since you've never been abandoned. Come on, tell me more. No, just, in, like don't I said... Get, in, don't tell in, me, no, tell me about a specific, dating, a specific incident that happened to you for, where you okay, were this is not, hurt this is and not therapy. This is not and This is not therapy relationship one-on-one with Maul, but... No, I've we're all, no, we're all going to talk. No, no, but, yeah, no it's not... Maul's just the only person talking now, but, no, but I, 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 I just No, you date women and things happen. Like, if you date if, if you date a woman and you find out, oh, she lied and, you know, guys that you you asked her about, if she if she actually dated or had been with, she said she didn't, and they come to find out she was actually still with them while y'all were dating mm. and shit like that. Like, that will make you move a certain way in other relationships. Like, sure. it's hard to trust women after that. It's hard to trust. And you can only really go off of your experiences. The other day, my mom, my mom, uh, or the other week, my mom said to me, oh, man, you're going to... Oh, you better be careful out there. You're going to get to a point one day where you don't trust women. And I said, gonna, huh? <laughs> yeah. So then I started to think, and I'm like, damn it. I don't think I trust women. But That's being jaded. It is. But you have reason not to. Yeah, but no, you can't let that. And you that's think, what I'm saying. I'm trying not to. specific to women? Or? Everybody has reason not to. Mm-hmm. But like I said, when and and what I'm doing now is in meeting new women, I try not to bring that energy into meeting new women. Like I try to forget about that. It's hard, but have you ever failed in that? Yeah, absolutely. Can you give us an example of that? I don't know. Of failing in what meeting a new woman and of meeting a new woman and trying to put some of your baggage to the side and not being successful in it. And that affecting the relationship. Yeah, well, I mean, just not, just not trusting. And then sometimes women are like, "Well, damn, like you don't trust me." So it's like, and I'll be like, "Yo, you know what? You're right. I don't." So, and if I, if I, it, it could have been a great relationship for me. That could have been a great woman for me. But me being jaded and not trusting and not allowing myself to move on, you know, it got in the way of that. But you know, it's not something that you can just do overnight. It takes a while to not be jaded and trust, and uh, you know. Have a healthy relationship. What What are your first signs that you think are untrustworthy? Signs? Do those come from your past? I don't really look for signs. I wouldn't say it's a sign. You just got to spend time with somebody, and because people have very specific you start developing flags. patterns, and you start feeling energy, and you like something's off, something ain't right, something ain't adding up, and then you start going back into your old brain, like oh I've been down, I I know what this is, or I know what this looks like, and then that gets in the way of you might be causing a bigger. Uh, thing than what it really is, is going on because of past shit. Hundred mm. percent. You know what I'm saying? But it's that's part of growing and getting to know yourself. Which is why I think being single for a while is is healthy because it helps you to get over a lot of shit. It helps you to look at shit differently, like get to know yourself and get to know the type of things that you're willing to deal with and not deal with. So when people ask me well, why how you been single so long, I'm like I need to be single. Honestly, I don't think I could have a, a relationship right now and it'd be like a real thing. Like I I just can't see it. Joe, how about you? How about me what? How do you feel about... You've been through a lot of very public... um, Messy (laughs) breakups. uh, A lot of things that would leave you jaded. How do you deal with that as a single man? And you kind of... I don't want to say serial monogamous, but you like relationships. Yeah, Yeah, you're serial monogamous. Well, because the the opposite end of that spectrum is maul to me. So there's no middle ground. (laughs) What would be the middle ground? Dating sometimes. Just giving it some time. Most Be single, be single sometimes. Date sometimes. Most dating. Uh, maybe not jump into relationships so quickly. I think you do that. I don't. I don't think so. You do. I think I have. I don't think I do on a regular basis. I think from the public's perception, they would see that. But in private, no. No, I don't, I don't think that would be the conclusion at all if people knew what went on behind closed doors. You don't think you jump in relationships quickly? No, I think I have. Okay. I don't think it's a repetitive. I don't think it's a repetitive thing. I think it's just happened a few times. How long have you been single? Well, right now. In the past seven years. You can't do that. You just named all my relationship years. I was with Sim for three years. Oh no, I was mad single before that. Mad? I don't know if he was mad single. Oh, no, yeah, he no, was, before that then, was, I was mad that single. Was, yeah, you were single. That, was, no, I was, I was, I was, that was the most single I've ever seen. I, I was there for a hot boy summer of yours. Yeah. And it was a few of those summers. <laughs> yeah. like, Mel- Melody was lit. Because before, <laughs> before then, if you, if, you, if you think about it, it was that old Kalen Terry's, and that was years. That was years of... 
You know what I mean? I was in and out with so you. Be, you might have been single for a year You be liking a, a bunch of pictures of some of that action. I was. <laughs> but your single is different than no, Maul's no, single. No, slow down. See, I don't like when Maul do that. <laughs> yeah. Maul. Yo, what was going on with you back then? Yeah, a whole lot of likes from you. <laughs> I don't... Uh, 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 underneath what was going on with me back then. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking yeah, I about, but I, yeah, I, know. I don't know, I know what you're talking anyway, about. Anyway, continue, but I, please. No, I, I, no, it's okay. Um, I, I, don't, I, think that, I think that you would benefit more from being single more. You know what's funny, though? You know what's funny, and this is why perception is just important. I think a few, a few I think, I think there's been a few instances. I think I try to fix broken shit. Oh, I'm guilty of that. Yeah, a lot of. I mean, I think, I think, I think that's human are. nature. Yeah. Human nature is to fix something that's broken. So I think there's been a few times where something appeared to be happening fast, but internally some shit was broken. Mm -hmm. And here come Joe to f come Joe to fix some broken shit. Mm -hmm. And then you get whatever you get from the relationship, uh, the other person anyway, and then, well, you feel you've healed or you don't need anything, and then you just move on, and then the guy's just left there with fucking mud in his face. Mm -hmm. That could lead to trust issues. I'm mm -hmm. glad that I stopped doing that, because that's a dangerous ground to be on, trying yeah. to fix someone that's not there, like trying to be savior man. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a bad thing. Or, or actively you. trying to fix themselves at the same time. Yeah, I'm right, about to say, right. sometimes you, you don't, you're not even fixed. Exactly. So you can't No, that's, that's the broken people are the ones trying to help the other right. broken people. Yeah. Absolutely, I agree. And completely ne neglecting themselves mm -hmm. and just yeah. continue on that cycle. Yeah. But which is why I say, I think it's when people like look at me like, how are you mentioning? And I'm like, I don't, I just don't think it's that crazy to be single for a long time. Like, I think that it's so many people, especially now you have access to so many people and different energy and, and people that you can meet all over the world. I think that now is is like I'm surprised someone hasn't grabbed you up. I yo, I kinda look at it the opposite now. I used to think that too, like how could you get in a relationship when you have access with one button to everybody? Right. I look at it and I view it as now I can see everything out there. Mm -hmm. And it looks fucking nuts. Which is which but which is why I'm saying it is it's, nasty it's, it's easy to be jaded now because like I said, you see so much and you taking a lot of that. Like we don't pay attention to exactly how much energy we take in and hold on to like that's because it's always in the back of our mind but subconsciously it's there mm. and then your brain will go to some shit and when you're you know dealing with somebody and you don't even realize like oh because i seen that whole situation play out and how that played out now in my mind i'm thinking like damn i'm trying to avoid some shit like that but you don't realize how that's playing into the current situation that you're in which is why me being single it's a lot i mean it has a lot to do with me like if i wanted to have a girlfriend and being like i could yeah. Absolutely. But do I think that I would be the best boyfriend right now? No, I don't. I don't think so. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't believe I would. I'm a. I'm a good guy. I'm a is good person. A, is that a? Is that a confidence issue? It's not a confidence issue. It's is that uh, a self esteem thing? No, I wouldn't say. It's, I don't. Why wouldn't you feel like? Why wouldn't you feel like that? Because I don't think honestly I could give a healthy a healthy relationship as much time as it demands. I don't think that I can give a healthy relationship as much energy as it demands right but now. But that would be by choice, right? Yeah, it's by choice. I'm, I'm just not ready to give that much energy and attention because it takes a lot of energy, a lot of time, and a lot of attention to build a healthy relationship. And I don't think that I'm in a position to give it that much time and energy right now. Well, do you yeah. think neglecting that is not allowing you to even try? Because how would you know? You're just I, I you're know, guessing. I, no, I know me. I've been single for long enough. Like I know me. How old are you? 37. When do you think this will change? Um, Hopefully within the next two years. So like I would want to have hope, a, a so healthy hopefully, relationship. So hopefully implies that it is something you would like to switch at some oh, point. Oh, no, absolutely. I want a relationship. I want to have a family. I you want to have, have kids? Absolutely. I want that. But I want it when it's right. I'm jaded in that And not saying it's going to always... Kids are scary. It's, not, it's never going to be perfect. Right. I'm, but I'm I want it... Marriage. I want it when it's like right. When I'm... When I know for a fact, like, yo, listen, I'm ready for... Do you worry about being too old and starting to have kids? Um, Sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes I think about it. Like, sometimes I think about being too old to kind of, like, get out there and be active the way you would want to be with your kids. Yeah. But um, I don't think I'm at that point yet. Maul, ask yeah. these niggas questions. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that. I kind of like y'all asking me them questions. It's therapy session? Not, not therapy, but it just, I like that. But they y'all are in relationships, like so. I can't really ask y'all like Happily. you. You can be jaded in, in a relationship. Can all, you, all talk things, about that. Yeah. Can you be jaded in a relationship? Hey, hey there you go. Yeah. yeah. And how does that affect and your it's, relationship? No, it's it's a whole new bag of of jadedness because everything you're talking about is at the beginning of my relationship, getting over those things. Mm -hmm. But once you get over that, you move into the next steps of however you view marriage, mm -hmm. however you view moving in with someone. Mm -hmm. 
however you view monogamy, however mm-hmm. you view just dealing with somebody every single day, and then you start realizing all the shit you saw in your childhood mm-hmm. and how that affects it. Got you. And so, you don't have these, and then at that point, it's almost too late, because now I'm with this person, I want to be with this person, and we just might be on two totally different pages. Because mm-hmm. you know in that fucking, you know, in the, in the dating mode, like... You're just talking shit. Like, you're not really sitting there really discussing marriage because you terrify somebody. Mm-hmm. Right. If you want to sit there and be like, well, these are my views on marriage. That's fucking weird. <laughs> it's scary and it's weird. Right. Yeah. So you don't ever really, really address those things until you get to that step. Well, no, I address them. Them bitches just be lying. <laughs> <laughs> I get right to it. So let me ask hey, you. Hey, you know, if we keep fucking at this pace, you'll probably get pregnant, right? <laughs> let me tell you how I I'm feel. Not I'm, not a, I'm not a scientist. Let, let me tell you how I feel about that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me just give you my views on that. <laughs> yeah, listen. But what? What you want me to do? No, so, I, I, I'm responsible for giving you the information. So in, in y'all relationships, have y'all ever felt Rory like... Rory and Parks. I'm here. Well, yeah. Rory and Parks. Yeah. Have y'all ever felt like your girl may have stepped out on you? No. No, I don't think so. Yo, men are so fucking delusional. And you know what? <laughs> Sometimes... And, Okay, not step. I don't, don't want to like, talk. I don't talk about this with another man. We're talking about my significant other to the world. I'm that, not in that respect. Mm-hmm. I don't think she has. But let's just put a whole let's different point. Yeah. Just let's do general. Yeah. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. Sometimes perception is okay in a relationship. I know that everyone else that's not in a relationship for a long time thinks like, "Oh my God, no! What are you talking about? Like you're supposed to be partners and best friends and everything. You're supposed to tell each other. Nah, like sometimes perception keeps a relationship going. Mm-hmm. Like, mm. me just not knowing shit and me not wanting to know shit mm. is fine. <laughs> no, but hold on. You Rory, not Rory knowing shit t- and not wanting to know shit is Rory, two different things. Rory with a 20-foot off the backboard. <laughs> a 20-foot off the backboard is nasty. <laughs> you didn't mean to Nobody do that. No, it's Tim Duncan's game. That's, that's... <laughs> yeah, no, sometimes... I, that's why I just... I laugh it at the timeline so much. And granted, I've been in a relationship five, six years, somewhere in that that range... And I know that's a small amount compared to a lot of people. Yeah. But I still have a little bit more knowledge than the people on the timeline that give this fucking fairy tale that they think a relationship should be. Right. Yeah. And it's not that. Yeah, it's never and you and and I, I don't want it to seem like I'm trying to look for the perfect cuz it's not that. You are. It's there's no such thing as a perfect person. No, I, and I know that. You do but, come off like that. No, yeah. but that's why I'm trying to put that I'm I know not, people I'm my, definitely not. I know that I will never have the perfect. I'm just saying I want to be at my best. And I don't think right now I'm at my best for a healthy relationship. I don't believe that. So yeah, but sometimes you jumping into a shit out with yeah, someone else. Yeah, Absolutely. I mean that, but yeah. but or it would be me being in a relationship right now and not knowing that I'm one hundred percent committed in there, and then it would be a lot of other bullshit I would have to deal with. Because it would be my bullshit. So now I'm in a relationship. I'm not spending time. Are you just I'm, picking fancy ways to say that you want to continue to fuck, fuck bitches? These bitches. <laughs> the more I'm listening no, to you. That's not it. Cause I don't, because it's not you, even cause cause, because saying, I'm not even that type of dude now. Because I don't know if you ever you, re- you can't really be ready de- for something. Yeah, and you're never really describing yourself professionally. You're okay, personally. But that don't have nothing to do with it, though. I know that's why I'm going to continue to listen. Say personally, your family has their health. Y'all mm-hmm. are all well. Everything mm-hmm. is good. You're well traveled. Mm-hmm. Your skin is fucking lathered. You're taking mm-hmm. good care of you yourself. You have a great hairline. Mm-hmm. Uh, you're charming. Mm-hmm. You're attentive. All of these things. You trying to take me on a date, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're, He's a trick, trying bro. to trick on you. <laughs> He's trying to trick on me, get my nigga. that money, bro. Uh, I can get more for at? free. Uh, where we at? Huh? Where we at? <laughs> I, can, I, can I don't know. You pay him every week. <laughs> no, I can get more for free. <laughs> well, yo, first of all, relax. I could. <laughs> relax. Calm down. We would smoke. No. <laughs> <laughs> that would be Maul's date to get him there, to get him in the crib. Yo, yo, I be there. Yo, yo, what if Maul be yo, no. tricky? Yo, Maul be like, yo, we Maul doing that? Yo, I was, tricky. I was thinking maybe we just chill in the crib and smoke. Maul's coming. Do you think I, I'm easy like that? I'm, yeah, you coming yeah. through. And Maul is dope because he ain't looking for a commitment. No, <laughs> I'm a jump off. Yeah, yeah. Now nah, you a jump off. You are. Yeah, but You're I'm wrong. saying I've been a jump off. It's okay. okay. All of these things that that you describe and all of these characteristics that I've seen you put on full display for for people that you may not be committed to. Mm-hmm. What's the difference? What do you mean? I'm just saying the, the shit that you're describing as to why you would not do something is not really in effect. It, mm-hmm. Like it don't, 
it doesn't appear that way. Or it's, I wouldn't be my best. I wouldn't be my best me. I wouldn't be my best self. I don't feel like I'm in a position to give the attention. And the, the, the man, keep like, these hoes, yeah, man. so it's I wish you would just not, say it's, that. It's then. not that because it's not like I'm. Hey, out the hoes is looking good. I but, understand. But, but no, but it's not that because it's not like I'm out here as a single man. Twenty five hundred. Oh. I'm not out here as a single man fucking a bunch of women for, for so, the ten grand. It's not even. It's not even about that. I just know that. I'm not ready to be in a relationship where it's like, okay, all of my time and attention is here. Like, I know I'm not. And it has nothing to do with wanting to fuck a bunch but of women. But you're not going like, to know that it. until you do that with that person. That's not true. Like, I think I, you're waiting for that. the perfect girl, and I don't think that's I don't know. It's I, definitely I, not I the think a majority of the successful race relationships are not people out there seeking a relationship. I think no, they I'm meet not, somebody no, no, and they no. go, oh, wow, I guess this is what no, I'm you doing. Sometimes you got to be like, this is pretty close. No, no, no. I'm not seeking anything. No, I know that. I want I'm saying, that, but I'm not seeking it. I'm saying I was where you were as far as your fancy way of saying I want to fuck bitches. Rory, drop jewels on them. <laughs> Yo, and, I was once where you were. Mm. No, Rory did that, so Maul didn't have to go through that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But, yeah, no, I was doing the, the running through the bitches thing, and then you meet somebody. It wasn't a plan. Ladies, Rory. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Nah, some of them were bitches. Nah, nah, it's, nah it was bitches. Yeah. <laughs> it's a difference between ladies and bitches. We know that. Some women, if I got lucky, <laughs> yeah. I was about to say it was <laughs> bitches. Um, but yeah, it wasn't something that I like. Was like, yo, I'm really ready for Look this. Rory tried to school us that he was the man at one point. <laughs> <laughs> I said bitches, nah, not women. No, nah, man, I was. I remember when I was running through the bitches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's not the man. Running through women is great. <laughs> bitches yeah. is some lower tier shit. <laughs> oh yeah, I wasn't like, yo, I'm I'm ready. I know I can give it my all, and I'm this person. I'm a whole person. No, you make it work if you want to be with that person. I, I'm, I'm but I you, had I had to figure that I'll out. Let you speak, but I know. Oh, Rory. Look at I you know listening that. to me and send shit. <laughs> yo, shut up, got my man. phone shut the, up. Up. <laughs> shut the fuck up, man. Look at you listening. Yeah, he yo, when you want to be with someone, you make it work. He's yeah, giving yeah, them yeah. all my Joe bars. Yeah. I've never listened to you and sent have a conversation. <laughs> the fuck up Rory <laughs> <laughs> alright Maul here's a question for you the tricker or the liar mm, trick or lie what do you mean the trick or the liar <laughs> sounds like the a tricker horrible show or the liar on, slash on MTV slash finesser you know the finesser mm-hmm. the guy in the text saying I miss you mm-hmm. constantly mm-hmm. the 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 guy is just fucking over attentive to everything, lying, lying his way in the panties. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what about it? What, what are you asking me? I'm asking you, how do you view that? Do you view that on the same scale as tricking? Do you view it as worse? Do you tricking view, with do you words. Do you view that as an effective method to lie and scheme women? Uh, an effective method? I mean, do whatever you feel like you need to do to get the woman you want, but. I mean, I, you guys, that's me, horrible advice. Isn't that, that's what all of this boils down to. Yeah, whatever you got to do to get the woman how, you want. How can you get your goals met and none of hers met? That well, is, no, because the trick, her goal is to get money. Mm, she so, wanted more than 2500 <laughs> Yeah, but if she got three given This is 25, a very specific amount you keep going back to. Because <laughs> that's the amount that I'm arguing that's with the going rate. Yeah. 2500 is not that's tricking. That's the status quo. Fam, if you, you got sound, it, you sound twenty five hundred is a lot of money, Joe. It's Maybe not to you, you but crazy. that's a lot of money. If a nigga has thirty million dollars, he pays twenty five hundred. You, you, you have thirty million. I'm not talking Finally, about me. Finally, he tells us his net worth. I'm not talking about, you, me. You, you, I'm not talking you, about me. My you mom want to know too. I'm not telling her. <laughs> you, no, you're just going Google. Yo, do y'all moms know how much money y'all make? No. Oh no. yes, my mom opened my uh, my mail. She she saw numbers. Wait, what'd you get? Who mailed? Someone mailed you a check? No, I had. You finally got that money from that first show. (laughs) No, I still didn't. That fifteen hundred. No, I still didn't. No, but she opened some of my mail that I had sent to Uh, to her. So she know what you made. Because I wasn't gonna be home, so I was like, I sent sent the mail there. Mm. She tried to like seal it back. I said, "Fam, fam, fam." (laughs) This is is open. (laughs) And next thing you know, two weeks later, yeah. So. You know, I've been seeing some. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. Now you need some. Yeah. yeah, I know. You, yeah, I know. you know, know the vibes. Yeah, I know. Parks your mom know? No. My dad does. No, my, my mom doesn't know, but she has an idea. Yeah. Some requests that's, have been made worst. that have never been made before. My mom before. don't care. <laughs> Come on, give me She's going to ask for what she wants. Give me some of them. Really. Uh, she wants uh, a brand new tub in her bathroom. <laughs> 
and and get gave it. me how oh, much yeah. it would cost. Nah, get the tub. Your no, you got it. No, no, no. I said no. I said yes. Yeah, you get the tub. Yeah, I said yes. Yeah. yeah. She Come seems on, to do say pictures. But the yeah, tub is like what, a very specific th- like that's not just like a oh, I can just plug it into the wall. I'm not like, mad yeah. at that it. sounds like one of those things I've I've wanted for years and years, but I won't spend the money frivolously on Well this. no, right. she mentioned I have a tub. She told right. me what the tub would cost, and that was fine. It wasn't cheap, but I, I was like, all right, that's fine. She didn't get into getting it installed and her bath her bathroom, that tub does not fit. <laughs> right. No, not, no, she need a bigger bathroom. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's not a it'll stop it. Fix it. Yeah, get a bigger bathroom next time. Right. right. Y'all got bigger not, venues for Duce. Get a bigger true, bathroom. Right. Knock down a wall. <laughs> right. Mom's wanna get her rev run on. She wanna sit in a big tub. <laughs> like bad. And shit. Yeah. She got Facebook now. I knew, yeah. I knew something was going on. My mom said, For my birthday, you can tell me what you make. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh no. I see that con. My mom is good. Yeah, they ain't gonna good. get that off on me, buddy. <laughs> uh, we'll stick to Hallmark. Uh, now, what some, we some roses. Oh, Maul didn't want to talk about the liar and the finesse. I didn't know. I, I know, know, I didn't, I I know he don't want to talk about it because he won't let me read his text. I didn't understand. What, <laughs> I, think, I didn't understand I think what you trick, asked. I think the trick is a better person. Yeah, is a better person. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Me too. You're judging. Yeah. Me too. Oh yeah, that's what we do okay. on this podcast. Yeah. yeah. And, and then say we're not. The trick is a better person. Yeah. Maul is in the text. So a trick could be a liar. Getting them off. I'm really He's not. Getting the lies you off? are getting. I you are you. in that text inbox. Text you, you might inboxing. be disappointed if you re- like read through my text. Let's see. Only one way to be yeah. sure. <laughs> now nah, the streets. The streets told me something about more. I'll, I'll tell y'all off, Mike. But mm. Yo, the streets. The streets. The streets, streets told me know something about more. Uh, me? Yes, you. No, they don't. Couldn't I don't be. Even be in then the who? Streets. Yeah, you. It's a thousand plus even, in the streets. So. I don't even. But I think. Barks. I think when I tell you, you're just gonna say yeah. So it's not that big of a deal. No. I don't, but the streets, I don't the streets have been talking about you. What? what I have and no not idea in what the New York streets. This is like not in the yeah, state. Yeah, yeah. The fly uh, out, the fly out streets. No, that's when you know it's creepy. No, a whole different set of streets is talking no, about, no, no, talk about more. Let's just say you got a master class just conveniently there coming up. Mm. Mm. That's not interesting. Convenient. I don't. I still don't understand what he's saying. But okay. Well, Those where, streets. where's your next master class? Is there a uh, VIP? Texas. And you're going to Texas. This, you're going to Texas this weekend too, right? Mm-hmm. Is your master class this weekend? No, but I am meeting up. With Not a, just that everything after some students. Bullshit. No, <laughs> helping helping the youth. <laughs> that was a little, tutor, little tutoring. <laughs> no, that nigga that more loves to tutor tutoring. something, right? <laughs> Yo, y'all be trying to pay me out as the nastiest, it's tr- sneakiest nigga on the planet. And I'm really no, not. I don't think you're sneaky. I'm that's really nasty. Not. Definitely, you're definitely. I'm nasty. not. Oh, all right, yeah, never mind. <laughs> um, all right. So listen, let's move on. LeBron found out what all of us knew. Uh, <laughs> he can't have Taco Tuesday. That nigga was bored. <laughs> he was bored. He just tried some, to pull, some real LA shit. He tried to pull some shit off that like you got to be super wealthy to get off. Like, yeah, no, nah, that's a thing already. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry that you didn't I'm know. Sure Taco oh, Bell would have got that first. But he just couldn't pull that off. No. Taco Bell wealthy. Close. How wealthy is Taco Bell wealthy? Pretty wealthy, I'm pretty sure. So we don't know. Hi. Let's look it up. I just think that this was something that it clearly was just a thing before he even... It's like, it's what a better thing. About? Yeah, yeah, like, well, I don't understand what you're saying right now. But, I mean, he gave it a shot. I respect it. I respect the attempt. They shot that shit right <laughs> Yeah, yeah, nah, yeah. They, they, they caught that shit off the glass. <laughs> All right, sorry, Braun. Next time. <laughs> yeah, bring the Taco Bell dude into the shop and talk about it. <laughs> and a lot of people in Cleveland was cursing me out, saying they do have great tacos, yeah. by the way. Wait, why were people from Cleveland cursing me out? Me like, too. They, were they said that I was trash in Cleveland. I would never. You know how much money I got in Cleveland? About 2500 Yeah. So, a specific asking amount? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'll do that verse. <laughs> You want 10K? Nah. <laughs> Just give me the 2,500. <laughs> That's all I, need. That's all I need. Shout out to our Spotify listenership, <laughs> our YouTube viewership. Uh, I'd like to shout out uh, Black Nurses. Uh, and that's what I got there. That's my intro that I forgot about. Okay. okay. And the good people of Cleveland. Shout out to Cleveland. Great people. Up yeah, there. man. The, Cle- the Clevelanders were fucking killing me. I'm like, whoa, I don't remember saying anything bad. Shout out to Ray Cash. Remember Ray Cash? Ray I Cash don't. was nice. I Ray Cash Ray was Cash. nice. I fuck with Ray Cash. Ray Cash was nice. You said shit about Delonte West? Oh, that was sad. Yeah. What happened with Delonte West? What happened? He's like living under a He's bridge like, or some yeah, shit. Strung out just on Which the bridge? bridge? Some shit in Dallas, I think. Oh, they yeah, got man. nice bridges. I mean, they do, but you shouldn't live there. <laughs> they got nice bridges. <laughs> it's good for driving over, <laughs> not so good for living under. How do you know? Oh, they got nice. <laughs> That's why Mo's going to Dallas. 
<laughs> of his man's house. Mo won't tell us why he's going to Dallas ever. He's here to support his friend at Tuesday Palooza. Yeah. I just want to see your phone. <laughs> Please. Please. There's nothing crazy in Please my phone, don't. bro. No. I, I don't, don't know what you it. think is in my phone, but it's not there. Don't worry about it. What else is going on that we need to discuss? We recap Power every week, and nobody comes in here with a, a Snowfall recap, even though Mo watches uh, faithfully. Mm -hmm. I don't understand that. Well, I tried to. The, you the, said the spoiler alert, so. I the, finale, the finale here, right? Yeah, the fin finale was uh was was Wednesday. Yes. Oh uh, come on, break Incredible, it down for man. us. It, I, it was uh the last I think maybe twelve ten to twelve minutes of the show was probably some of the best TV I've seen in a long time, and it wasn't even no dialogue. It was just like it was kind of like just poetry, like just the shit that was going on, the damage that they have like created. Like acting poetry, like Michael yeah. B. Jordan. It, no, it was this was better than Michael B. Jordan. Like face acting. It was no, it was uh, it was more like just uh, images and and just shit that was going on around them, and then it, I guess it finally it finally started hitting them like, damn, like, like yo, we damn is we we this shit got bigger and out of, more out of control than we thought, but it was just dope the way they did it, just the 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 the, the music that they chose to play, it was just dope, and I, I I didn't expect to see that on FX, that felt like a a, a movie or like a HBO Showtime. Mm -hmm. Type of thing, but it was it was dope. A lot of people didn't like it; they didn't understand it. But I understood it. It was you know him going through his uh, memory and re replaying things. If things happened this way or played out that way, and you know the the end was, all right, uh, I I'm trying to salvage as much as the community as I can, so I'm going to need the government's help. And they showed exactly how smart he is because he talked about how the government came in and helped L.A years before that and since he's working with a CIA agent he let him know like I'm gonna I'm gonna need the government to come in and help too but we still need to get this money so sounds season four good. is gonna be crazy sounds good so we gotta yeah. wait and I love the that. way they implemented John Singleton into it like oh did they did they find a way yeah he uh they, they showed an image of a, a young kid in the in the community that was running around with his camera at a young age oh that's fine and the gangbangers were telling you get out of here with that camera you just putting everything on film for the police and he was like, what oh, you doing dope. with that camera? He was like, I'm, I'm making a movie. And he was like, nobody from the hood make movies. But the dude was dressed like John Singleton in Good. the little shirt and the That's hat dope. and the That's glasses. Dope. So it was dope to, that they kind of did that and, and paid tribute to, to John Singleton. I thought that was really dope. But yeah, the last 10 to 12 minutes of that episode was really, really powerful. End of the month, my, my, white, boy, my white boy show come back, A Million Little Things. What's that one? A Million Little Things. A million, little, a million Little Things comes on, I want to say, ABC. Okay. Um, and there's no way for me to explain it without really giving it away. But it's one of my favorite shows when it comes back. I finally started watching that Wu-Tang shit. That shit is really good. Yeah, I got to get back into episode three. It's really good. Like, usually when they do the throwback hip-hop, it don't come good. up, it's bad. <laughs> Yeah, the first, first is really good. But that, they don't do that often, though. It's happened they? a couple times. Yeah, it's happened a couple times. Like the whether it, whether it's one. a movie or a, or a Netflix, like the um, what was the shit on Netflix called with uh, the same dude from that plays Raekwon, wasn't it? Uh, the get get down, get down. Yes, the get uh, not so good. The get something. Yeah, the, yeah. The get down. They tried to just do too much. Like, yeah, it was. It was the like story a story of hip hop. They, it was a musical. Then he was like in super love and crying every other scene over this yeah. chick. Like. They just tried to do way too much with that show. I agree. I agree. I'm trying to get into the... Um, I got to... Well, not get into I'm trying to find a time to watch the spy shit that's on Netflix right now. I heard that's good, too. Yeah, I got to... That's it, on my, my uh, cue. It looks really, really, really good. Yo, listen. Yeah. The Righteous Gemstones. I don't know if y'all started that on nah. HBO. They know something. Danny McBride. Oh, I mean... You should be. <laughs> Danny McBride. Hilarious. hilarious. Uh, okay. Oh, it's a comedy. It's a comedy. Oh, it's Danny yeah. McBride. You know, yeah. he's bound and down. Yeah, uh, yeah. Vice like, principles. Yeah, yeah, that's like you know what that's about. Stupid, hilarious, <laughs> hilarious uh, show. I don't generally for, like to laugh for when the I'm people. Uh, <laughs> for the people that can't find something to watch with their significant other, uh, the Good Place I started, which is it's that like sounds familiar. It's like a it's a comedy. It's about uh, a chick. The Good Place is their version of heaven, and like only a real sp specific group of people get to go but they mistake her for one of those people and she's a really shitty person <laughs> and it's pretty funny okay. it's one of them shits you, you both will enjoy oh, and not suffer nice. oh, I like oh, those <laughs> Is that a nice no, I'm, trying, I'm, trying help, I'm trying to help people man <laughs> these people are funny it's, it's a funny show yeah oh, well, thanks, yeah. Is I'm, it try, I'm trying to help is it funnier than the Righteous Gemstones probably not 
Okay. Dude, but then Brian's again, women don't like things that are very funny. So you have to find things that are like in that neutral. I honestly zone. can't believe Righteous Gemstones is on like television. Like the the language that they're using in that shit is like this cannot be on TV in 2019. But it is. It's funny. I think y'all would. They gotta keep it. up with the unrated shit. Well, I'm gonna check it out. No, you should. You'll like <laughs> it. You'll definitely like it. Um, what else is there, Rory? Tell me what's happening with Bobby Brown and JetBlue or whatever <laughs> airline Bobby Brown is it's, fighting it's with. It's not not See, much. Niggas to still it. ain't found Johnny Gill. Jamel Hill found Johnny Gill before Bobby Brown. <laughs> <laughs> He's at the Murphy. Johnny Gill just put out an album, I think. Yeah, his new edition on it. I don't think so. See, shady. I think I saw. I don't know if it's some type of re-release, but I saw a Johnny Gill album really recently. I was like, he's going on tour with Eddie. Anyways, uh, Bobby Brown, yeah. Rory, you gonna get your ass <laughs> one of these things? <laughs> I caught that. Yeah, that's, don't think that's I didn't cover. catch that bar. <laughs> that's a new album. Yeah, it's new. Johnny, that's Gale a horrible album. cover. <laughs> Now they shitting on a Johnny Gill album. <laughs> that cover looked like he passed away. Like obituary. Yeah, that's what it looked like. It looked like a uh, prayer card. Yeah, it looked like he passed away. They're like, yo, home going services. <laughs> might be fire on it. There might, might be, some be. fire on it. Johnny Gill is fire. Uh, yeah, Bobby Brown got removed from a JetBlue flight because he was drunk. Not much here. Not much there. Ralph, Ralph <laughs> that, sounds there. Like, that sounds like a, a Bobby Brown flight. I was, I was flight. just writing things down. Why I can't never be at the gate when Bobby Brown is there, like, <laughs> drunk? He's got Santana on there. It's got to be fire. Drew Allen's. <laughs> if Johnny Gill and Joel Santana did record together, let me tell you who the, the first person jail clicking on. Uh, don't, don't act like uh, Joel's and Chris Brown didn't get their party jumping. Oh yeah, but first of all, that song with was rape- "Run It." That song was rapey. Oh, they talking about "Back to the Crew." No, that song is rapey. It. She oh, don't so she many. don't know it, but she going back to the crib. Yeah, why know. doesn't she know? Yeah, I don't think it's weird that Rory can spot out everything rapey, like it's right at the tip of his brain. No, uh, he studies the rapey songs. Have y'all ever been sexually abused or assaulted or molested? <laughs> no, man. Where did that come from? <laughs> and who would answer that question like that? No, yeah, you, who asked that question like that? in the like middle that? of a Johnny Gill yeah, segment. Yeah, yeah. You asked us like you asked us if we wanted a burger or a shrimp. Like, like yo, does anybody... I used like, making an order or some shit that was asking if we wanted something. Like, has anybody been molested or what? So, no. No. Oh, oh fun. Now that you mentioned it. <laughs> I, hark, I harken back to Sunday, <laughs> Sunday school. Like, what? Oh, I've been dying for someone to ask. <laughs> That's all I've been trying well, to say. Well, when I was young... <laughs> Now that we're here, <laughs> no, no. Well, shit, I figured I would ask. Well, people don't ask. They just assume it never happened to their friends. So I want to ask yeah, you Yeah, but Joe, you don't ask that <laughs> on the number one podcast in the world. <laughs> no, that's true. Yeah, like, that's just, true. just yeah. randomly. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, any of y'all have been molested? <laughs> I know. All right. No, Joe. You're just joking. I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> look at Bobby Brown. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got to look at Bobby, man. <laughs> oh, my God. But, I know that drunk face, too. Yeah, like too. when you just want to be drunk by yourself, like just leave me the fuck alone yeah. and be drunk in peace. And it's a black, at the airport. It's a black cop. He know exactly who that is. He like, come on, Bobby. Like, stop this shit, man. You drunk? Just, just come on. What uh, did Bobby do? They was being cruel. <laughs> this thing is so cold. Oh, this thing is so cold. Come on, man. They were being cruel. <laughs> Yeah, Joe. Yes. Nah, for real. Look at him standing over by. Don't first of all, don't stand over me. No, that's, but that's what he's saying. <laughs> don't that's exactly it. what he said. Yo, don't why are you standing over me? Over me? Don't, don't standing over me is bad. Don't do that. It's gonna lead to something bad. <laughs> wow. All right. So Bobby was drunk, and that was it. They yes. let him on the plane. That's it. Was he arrested or? I don't think so. Okay. Well, look at the RMZ. <laughs> RMZ <laughs> killing it. Yeah, word. You got. I mean, more? but who hasn't been drunk on a plane and got kicked off? That's Come on, RMZ. Give us some more news. What other news you got for us? Dun, 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 dun! The real, the real, real news. Uh, Bang Bros plans to submit a ten million dollar bid for naming the rights to the Miami Heat Arena. Uh, they would like to name it the BBC Bang Bros Center. Yo, can we <laughs> can we just give you know Rory just reminded me? Can we give Lisa Ann some credit? She needs some flowers. Like Lisa Ann is like the the. She's still fucking <laughs> for twenty five hundred, <laughs> and we still watching. <laughs> <laughs> she made a comeback. She she's no, back. she made me come back. All right. <laughs> Oh, because she retired at one point? She retired for a while. Can you, can you really Once retire? Once you got that nail and pail and money, you can yeah, sit t- back for a little while. <laughs> <laughs> what porn stars have really Lisa, retired? Lisa Come on. ain't going to get money for the rest of her life. I didn't see her go in too many rooms and bust it down like the equalizer. <laughs> she just Lisa. went there and started handling everybody. <laughs> 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 Yo. What? 
And I know something is wrong with me because why does that get it going for me? <laughs> like, ooh, like she had a room. Oh, She's not done yet. Yo, she handling all of these. Yo, you niggas. start looking at the time left on the video. Like, yo, how much longer she got? This shit is thirty-seven minutes oh, left. Oh my, yo, Lisa and man, 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 if twenty-five hundred got it done. <laughs> it might. No, well, nah, nah, she got nah, it. Lisa not, probably got nah, the paper. You're not getting Lisa. I am for twenty five hundred. Shit. You might You'd be surprised. Yeah, you bro. might. I would. <laughs> you you could get like the younger, more popping ones for less than that. No, 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 no. no I think you no, can. No, no, yeah, no, I'm, I'm sure. telling you this. No, no, I'm not, but I wouldn't be looking for the younger, more popping Lisa Ooh, Ann. A couple. I'm looking for old ass Lisa nah. Ann to come in there and do the equalizer <laughs> yeah, on me. You get, you get, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just you. Yeah, wash yeah. the windows. Yep, yeah, just Joe here. <laughs> Go ahead, pump it. Lisa Ann. She's a she's been around for a while. She's a soldier. Y'all ever get into vintage a soldier? <laughs> Y'all ever get into vintage porn? No, that's all I watch is vintage. For porn. real, you hit the nineties still? Yeah, is that is that a category? Nineties? I'd be in the seventies. <laughs> oh, you sick. fuck is you talking? They don't make them like that no more. That's a lot. <laughs> They don't make them like the 70s. Mad missionary and oh, Bush. Oh, man. Tickle, 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 Ron Jeremy was going crazy. Yeah. Now watch the 70s. Yo, once that beat come on, I'm grabbing yeah. the Lou. Tickle, 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 tickle. I'm, I'm, I'm hitting shag pause. <laughs> yeah. Heart-shaped bed. 100%. Oh, my God, yes. A lot of leather. Yes. <laughs> Lisa Ann. Why are we talking about Lisa Ann? Because Rory's going to segue us into the next news topic. Come on, Oh, Bang Bros. Okay. Yes. Oh, Bang right. Bros. That's what yeah. we're talking about. Yeah. Listen, I'm, 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 I think I'm they with. should do it. Yeah. That'd be dope. I don't know if 10 million going to get it done. But they should try. Where was this? Miami. Miami. They should try Vegas. Vegas might well, let Miami The Raiders might let that might be more. Yeah, but they'd have to probably bid more than 10 million for Vegas. Bang Bros is good to give you blue balls. <laughs> Give you well, when, and the little if, teaser when, clip yeah, ain't gonna do yeah, it. Yeah, when you weren't subscribed, <laughs> it was just a teaser. When you were, and then if you watched too many teasers, you couldn't watch anymore. Fuck. No, I got, I got <laughs> yeah, you reached no, out. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're friends of the show. Oh, Bang Bros. Yeah, I got the plug. Yeah. Remember, I sent you. Remember, I sent you the code. We got a Bang Bros password. I sent it to you. Send it again. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> Send it again. I might, have been, I might have been with I, somebody. I put it in the, looking, I put it in the group chat. Looking yeah. down at masturbation, Send but that changes code. when they leave. <laughs> bang bros. Yeah, no, they're, they're friends Quality of the show. Site. A bang bros password? Bang bros, a name you can trust. <laughs> you can absolutely trust You that can name. trust bang bros. You can. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. I'll be watching this shit like, oh, she's going to get in the van. <laughs> Do you think they're always surprised <laughs> every time? You are always surprised. Yeah. Like she actually yeah. got it. <laughs> do, you think, Yo, they, do you think they'll get they this be, one? No, no, she's not gonna do it. Yeah. Yo, the van be looking like a piece of shit. Word. Window yeah. rolled down, camera out. Mad sharky Can't, on the it's ceiling. Five niggas in there. Yo, come in and get fucked. <laughs> Yo, you looking for a good time? Hey, they get right in. You they see, get right in. My favorite girls. Yeah. Like she's Damn. so pretty, you she shouldn't be doing that. Oh, why are you doing that? <laughs> Come on, I could have saved you. Just keep I got walking. 25. Oh, you're broken. Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> you're broken, and where are you? I have 2,500. I have to come and save you if you're broken. <laughs> Get out of that van. Get in with me and so. And then they leave the girl. They throw her clothes out. <laughs> That's the nastiest. Get in with me and so. ever. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, oh so. man, yo, give me send a pass off that Bang Bros password if you have. Yeah, I, need I got you. I'll yeah, put it in the group chat. Because you married, you married in a small crib. You ain't doing it justice. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't not doing what you thought. No, not proper at proper. all. <laughs> and you got probably the uh, open kitchen that's connected to the living room, so there ain't only but so many places you could sneak and get a, a jerk off. No, I got, I got. Yo, the is, is watching porn when you're in a relationship is that considered cheating? I hope yes. not. It is. What? Yeah, with a Spanish girl. <laughs> <laughs> But is it though? Spanish girls be appalled that you even talk to other women like during your day. Like your mom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they take everything to heart. Like, yo, no, that's my real first cousin. <laughs> like, what the fuck is we wrong with you? We have the same you? last name. They take, they start tripping over it all. So that is a thing. Word that bitch got you heart. Yes, Look. I went to that site. <laughs> it's favorited. <laughs> <laughs> I have the password. Hey, what well, girls? You know, you you like that big bitch? Yes. <laughs> I do. That's oh, my shit. Oh, that's what you're into? Yes, bitch. Why, why are you trying to demean it? <laughs> why are you talking down on my yeah, point? Yeah, god damn it. Yeah, I didn't know that was. Con- well, I guess I can see why that's considered. That cheating. should not be considered cheating. I can see why it is, though. It it's shouldn't not. be, though. It should not. Well, we can sit here and tell you it definitely should not be considered, but I can see why. There's a lot of things we think should be different. <laughs> right. But I want to know why, though. 
I was in the middle of a cheating conversation the other day. <laughs> Niggas say just stupid shit during those conversations. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's all stupid when you think about it. You're right. It's all stupid. I'm, I promise you. When you think about everything you said, you're like, what the fuck was I talking about? <laughs> like, what the fuck was I talking they about? They be right. It, exactly. <laughs> they be right. They exactly. Man, right. Exactly. <laughs> they be right. It, it's true. I found myself in the middle of trying to argue, like, the degrees of cheating. <laughs> no, that's where you get fucked up. Yeah, you lost. That's you where you get lost, fucked up. buddy. You can't yep. do that. The degrees is different degrees of yeah, cheating. You already lost. No, you lost. Cheating is cheating. I'm sorry, buddy. No, I agree. Yeah. <laughs> it was bad. It was horrible. Yeah. So that's why I said I can't see why women would be mad at men or their boyfriends visiting or Bang Bros. Yeah, watching porn. I, I, I get it. Might have said some shit like, "What the fuck was I supposed to be faithful to that?" Bro, what? Is, you did not try to get that off. <laughs> Bro, I be feeling like Aaron Rodgers sometimes. Down by thirty, <laughs> nah, you just kicked it out of bounds. Uh, feeling like Aaron Rodgers sometimes. No. Like I could get it in the pocket. No, I could get the ball right no. to the numbers. No. That was a pick six. No. Doesn't look like there's a window there, no. but no, if I just was... no, you run our test in the stands. Yeah, yeah. it worked. Yo, what? You tried to get that off? I did. Oh, you all fucking crazy. It didn't work. I know. No, no. you got to tell us it didn't it work. I bet not. What can men use nowadays that will work? Nothing, man. Silence. When it comes to cheating, well, no, you just it doesn't just work either. And just eat and shut up. Just eat and shut up, man. Just take it. It's, it's no, it's no way. Once it's a cheating situation, let it just let her have it. Because anything you say is gonna be wrong. Yeah, I mean, you're not winning that one. Can be used against you in the court of girlfriend. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. The court of girlfriend me. is wild. Shit like the NFL. No man has ever made <laughs> it out of the court of girlfriend. Rules. It's the scariest court in the world. You're not going to win in the court of girlfriend. No. Nah. Every, it, there's a 99% lose rate for every man. And there's, there's no stenographer. I don't. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? Show I, me what she but said. Wait, <laughs> but you know, none of that. But there's you know, no records. No. no. But you know what I've also expressed in those situations? See, and we need some, we need some shit that comes from men to be given credence from women. Because you know what I've... <laughs> all, you, sorry. <laughs> you know what I've so, also sorry. expressed in some of these types of conversations? Like, I don't do well in this talk. <laughs> <laughs> this, ain't, this ain't my shit. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't my bad. Yeah. Like, I don't like being put under pressure from somebody who loves me. Yeah. Nah, I don't, I don't respond well. I don't test well. Right. I don't, I, I don't do it. That's and and I don't, I don't I don't want to wake up to this. No. That's not gonna. I wake up bad to this. That's not gonna hold over well. And none of it does. No, none of it works. You just got to sit there and say you're right. Yeah. I never do that. You have to. You right? They don't be right. Even if they not right. <laughs> now they be right. They just don't argue it right. Yeah. <laughs> like you find an opening. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, yeah. Oh, that's what that's what you that's, that's what you want. Oh, hold only up. Boop, boop, <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Only women Bitches can, argue so dumb Yeah only women Can make sense Make no sense Like you're right <laughs> Yeah But As soon as you now, now you're wrong Now that you're into How you felt about it <laughs> Oh if you in your feelings bag Let me wiggle out of this one Alright Losing our female audience Yeah Well Wendy one Williams heard us time. She heard, She had to listen to our last podcast What'd she say We were talking about uh, Living with your girl And like You know maybe Maybe she just buy her Another crib and y'all could live separately. <laughs> Wendy Williams said her next in her next relationship, she wants to put dude in another crib. We'll Smart just move. we'll just live somewhere else. Smart yeah. move. And she said that before us. Oh, did she? Yeah. I saw it today. <laughs> she said what? <laughs> y'all notice that Rory hasn't been seeing or listening to very much lately. <laughs> he's been moving. He just yeah. hasn't finished anything. Listen, he's got to move. What did Wendy say? Are you still moving? I'm still in the unpacking phase. Damn. Oh, but you're in though. Yeah, oh, yeah, I'm in. Okay. I'm in. It's not the not, not the most comfortable sleep yet. No, we bedroom is straight. I know, but the house is still in a little disarray. Amongst a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> what else? We talk. I was a joke. Bro, no, we no. talk. I was a joke. We're here for you. That bro. was a joke. Talk. Everything is lovely. What else it is in a the joke? Disarray. Jaded. It was joke. Yes. <laughs> jaded. <laughs> Where are we at? Okay, that's where we are. So listen, Fashion Week is over, right? Fashion Week is over. We didn't get a real a recap. Round of applause because Maul. Maul, our fashion insider, decided not to do one. Um, <laughs> How he, often is Fashion Week? He's inside it enough today, though. So uh, I believe once a week. Uh, yeah, I, I feel like that shit is every other week. Mm-mm. 
Who's going to answer the question and inform people? What he fashion show did you go to, Mo? I didn't go to any of them. But it's a men's fashion week and women's fashion week, so. Oh, is that That's what it is? Like, uh, yeah, so. That's sexist. That's not inclusionary. Is it? I double mean, it's I men's double fashion standards. and women's fashion, though. Well, only, well d- it depends. I only, you it, us. I only brought it up because uh, Rihanna had an after party. and We weren't invited. <laughs> we weren't invited, but I saw a lot of pictures and videos of people next to Rihanna, Rihanna taking pictures and videos. and I would, too. Really? No, you wouldn't. No, you I, wouldn't. I, I want a picture of Rihanna. You, you would not go stand next to Rihanna and pull your phone out and... No, I wouldn't. I don't know how to. ...video. But I want a picture of Rihanna. Foot. Yeah, but that's kind of <laughs> my point. All of these people look stupid and pathetic. You all look like idiots. <laughs> what, recording videos of Rihanna? Or taking pictures of Rihanna? All of it. You're privileged enough to be in Rihanna's presence and you want to sneak a vid... <laughs> I just I just wonder if the people that do it, you know, because you look at Rihanna and you look at her in a certain light and see her a certain way, so you want to take the picture in the video. I wonder if these people ever realize how the person that they see in a certain light th- is looking at them. You look like a fucking da dun da dun. Yeah, sneak the, sneak the picture is nasty. crazy. Yeah. Ew, it looks nasty. And if that was my only point picture, in bringing up yeah. Fashion Week. It just looks nasty. Nah, if there's one person I wouldn't do it around, it's Rihanna. You yeah. wouldn't sneak a video. Huh? You wouldn't sneak a video. Around Rihanna? No. Nah. I don't think I've never snuck a video. I've never snuck a video. Snuck a video <laughs> like, period. I thought you were talking about just in general, like a photo with said person. No, nah, they was doing a lot. It looked nasty. No. Nah. It looked nasty. That was my own that was my only takeaway. That's <laughs> all I have for you. You didn't there. see any new fashions that were inspired, nah, no new cloaks I was, or I wasn't looking at the no. Nah. Damn. Even though I wouldn't mind some new cloaks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what else is going on that we need to inform people about? Somebody's dissing Drake. Uh, Wiley is dissing Drake. Wiley, uh, I'm reading here, the godfather of grime is reigniting his beef with Drake. I don't really know about the original beef with Drake. Um, but he's reigniting his Drake, uh, his, his Drake, his, uh, Drake beef. And he is saying that Drake uses artists. Apparently he was signed to OVO at one point. I, I didn't know. I'm just reading it. Relatively unclear as to what triggered the one-sided bombardment. Huh, I know all about those. <laughs> <laughs> it seems Wiley has been increasingly irritated with OVO shit record deals, specifically in relation to the clearance of vocals on a song he did alongside dancehall artists and OVO signed artist Popcan, as well as Nicki Minaj. Popcon. Popcon, I'm sorry. Uh, going out of his way to say, at Drake, suck your mom, don't come back to England, to directly, uh, to directly calling Drake a culture vulture. Furthering, further claiming that OVO will give you shit record deals and you're only there to help Drake with songs to keep him up and you down. All right. <laughs> uh, sounds well, like a record deal. Sounds like the music business. <laughs> Continue on to uh, my guy right after that. Uh, the MC also <laughs> went out of his way to call out Ed Sheeran. How wow. could he? What? Wow, Rory. How For dare? No, behavior. the Drake stuff was fine. The Nicki stuff was fine. Podcast stuff was fine. Don't you dare. <laughs> Go near Ed, the God MC, Big, Big Eddie. <laughs> Big Eddie. They Big call him Big Eddie, Eddie. <laughs> uh, for similar mm. <laughs> for similar behavior. Calling out the singer songwriter, calling the singer songwriter a pagan. <laughs> What's a pagan? That's a wild diss. A pagan. Well, it says right after a word often oh. used in grime. To oh, okay. describe someone as fake and inauthentic. Oh, the music industry is full of pagans. <laughs> Pagans are like the people that invented Halloween and uh, Christmas, putting up Christmas trees. Christians. Oh. Yeah, close enough. <laughs> did, y'all, did y'all see uh, uh, they had, uh, Dwayne Wade? Rory, that was really funny, actually. It was. <laughs> what were we saying? Nothing, Nothing man. Continue. Continue. We don't want to yeah. say it again. Yeah. But he's yeah. No, I, I don't. Oh, fuck, no, I no. almost said edit that out, but yeah. continue on. Oh, I got to listen to Wait, should we edit it out? No, no, we're fine. <laughs> no. Did y'all see Dwayne Wade uh, saying that he refuses to let his kids believe in, in Santa Claus because he don't want them to believe in some white man breaking into the house at odd hours of the night? I think that's, <laughs> I think that's a Cat fair. Williams joke. People are just, like, just thinking way too deep, man. It's okay to let kids believe in Christmas. I was with him. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's Cause, Chris, well, cause Chris, what Chris. is the point of that? 
Well, the, the story of Christmas is a great story of giving and, and sharing and things like that. But I, he's minimalizing oh, it to just it's the white more man. Capitalism. No, it absolutely. All of them are capitalism. Ab- but I'm, right. what I'm saying, even behind the capitalism stories, lying to kids and adults across the world. To no, but what I'm saying is, I'm not. I understand the what you're saying. The Tooth Fairy, the Easter Bunny. No, I understand what you're saying. Halloween, Christmas, yeah. all of it. New Year's Eve, your birthday. Shut up. <laughs> your birthday. <laughs> but well, yeah. Don't you dare actually, celebrate your, your birthday. birthday definitely you pagan. I'm just saying, you, they put you here to kill you anyway. Pagan. <laughs> but, yeah, what the fuck? But it is it is a good message behind the holiday, though. I understand what you're saying, and I agree Schools, with what you're saying. All of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, Everyone should just sit home and podcast. What? <laughs> Quit your jobs <laughs> Podcast oh, And quit Christmas Oh please don't start and that Podcast Yeah Podcast through Create Christmas. Create through it Create through Christmas <laughs> See and that right there Is exactly why I hate y'all Y'all a joke out of something And didn't have nothing To come back with after the joke What do you mean? Oh we was waiting I'm for with you on capitalism I don't remember What we were talking about now I thought you was gonna finish Reading capitalism about pagans oh, I'm finished with these pagans Okay these pagans. Did you read the thing about The uh, California is Passing gig economy laws Where instead of 1099 people Well you can 1099 people But you have to offer them uh, Benefits Like health benefits And things that you would offer Full time employees No I didn't hear that And that's crazy It's a pretty big deal There's But how, the, does, how does that work If I'm just Say I'm a vendor for one thing For a week Out of the year I don't know I'm not sure what the limitations are as far as how much time you have to work or how much money you have to it be paid. Right. My, uh, or my, or money, I'm here. sure. Yeah. My, my whiteness is really about to come out. If you work for me for a week, yeah. I'm not giving you health insurance. <laughs> here's, here's a check for your services. Yeah. And go figure that shit out. Well, well, what if I, they get hurt on the job? Like, What if you hire somebody to do some home improvement stuff? I think the issue oh, is. Then, yeah. I think the you issue is me. mostly based around like Uber drivers not being able to get health benefits, even though they're essentially full time employees. Well, this of is why we just need universal health care to begin with. I just give it to everyone. Of drive bad. <laughs> That's true too, Joe. A lot. They still need health benefits, though. They need. I health agree. Benefits. That was an independent statement. Oh, okay. M- musicians need health benefits as well. There's a lot of independent contractors, myself mm-hmm. included, mm-hmm. that do not have health coverage or not have good health coverage. Because it's not really offered because I work for 50 different people. Metro, Metro they Plus, don't baby. want us to have it. Correct. They don't want you guys to stay alive. Correct. <laughs> yeah, which is how they banned uh, e-cigarettes and all of that when six people died. But guns are <laughs> but, still but, available. You know, when I read that headline, Walmart. yeah, I, it was bad, but I really started laughing. Like, um, out loud. America's just funny. Oh, now the, now the uh, vapes and shit is evil now that y'all fucking... Cornered the weed market, huh? Mm-hmm. Or, <laughs> this, That's exactly what it is. It is a bunch of fucking malarkey. malarkey. And I think they sell uh, vapes in Texas, and that's right by Columbia. So mm. if you really think about yeah, it. Yeah, you're right. Damn. If you, Actually, if you, if you connect uh, everything. Going back to that Brazil conversation, I, uh, a friend of mine went to an uh, uh, economic summit situation, and I love uh, because of the tariffs that is happening, tariff situation with U.S. and Japan, U.S. is the leading world's leading manufacturer of soy. The second largest manufacturer of mm-hmm. soy is Brazil. Mm-hmm. China is they the biggest use, market for soy. Because the soy sauce. using the land and the rainforest? Yeah. So they're burning yeah. that shit down to build soy. Yeah. Make more soy. Yeah. Gotcha. That makes a lot of sense. We know it was a money thing. Yeah. All right, man. Just give us health care. For real. <laughs> Go Bernie. That's what you're voting for? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I'm with you, man. 100%. I'm with Bernie. Um, feel the burn. I'm not with voting. I'm feeling the burn. Feel nah, the burn. you got to vote, Roy. Yeah, please. You and, and, and don't misuse your platform. Yeah, for nonsense. real. Please, please, enough of it. You be independent all you want. Go do it. Rory don't want to vote, but he'll be the time. first one at the I airport. Vote. I paid yeah, to I get know. through with my laptop. <laughs> I, <know. laughs> I don't want to take I, uh, my shoes off. I'm a huge advocate of voking, voting a locally. Vote. And voking. And voting. <laughs> and, vo- <laughs> and voting. And voting. Mm-hmm. I vote locally all the time. I'm an active voter in voting locally. You just don't pay attention to the president. I'm... T- these past two elections, I voted for president before. White people are crazy. Like white people get to do that. When well, I vote, yeah, white people just get to pick and choose. You haven't you voted elite. in the last election? Yes. I don't believe you. You don't. You don't have to. I was the only <laughs> one on tour that, by mail and online, found a way to vote. The only. Wait, you wasn't on tour last week. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yeah. Yes, I was. Yeah. Really? And it yeah, was and absolutely it was, Rage the Machine tour. Yeah, it took, oh, yes. Yeah, okay. I had to find a way to get that vote off. I was going to get that vote off. Yeah, and I remember that. And I, it was a little disappointing that the entire crew I that, did not that vote we were on the road with didn't vote. 
Yeah. And I was a little, uh, I was a little upset by it, but I didn't say anything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you know, Rory can come in here and talk about how he won't vote for the presidential election. I, nigga, s- I said this, this past one, I did not, because there was not a candidate there. Well, they asked you about the next one though, and you was like, "Nah, fuck that." As of right now, I, I don't see a candidate that I would want to vote for. Bernie Sanders. Yeah, I think he's the one that's closest. He's the closest. To what yeah, absolutely. We believe in and what we would want to make changes. Yeah. I think he's the closest one. Yeah. They, we, then none of us is going to ever be the prototypical what we would, would more than want as a president. But sometimes you just got to go with you know the person that's like okay, similar to dating. Yeah. <laughs> I will vote though. I want to vote this yeah, year. Bernie. I'm Absolutely. Bernie. Even though I feel like in New York, he's going to win this state anyway. If he wins. if if he wins the Democratic yeah. nomination, you guys are awesome. Yeah. Why do you no, say? I feel, I feel that way. Like. Like with 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 uh, Clinton last year, I knew she was gonna win New York. All right? That was well, not last year, but last uh, uh, presidency. Well, your vote counts more. No, it does. True I me. believe that. I believe my vote counts. Okay. But I knew she was gonna win New York. Like I don't even think Trump campaigned in New York. Did right. he? I briefly. I don't remember. I, he didn't spend. He knew, a lot he, of knew time. he wasn't winning New York. Yeah, like Long Island. I'm sure. Yeah. Long, Long Island, yeah. Staten Island, the islands. He was. Oh, the he islands. was very active. No, oh, okay, <laughs> got it. Yeah, but he knew he wasn't winning. Yeah, but go out and vote. Yes. I'm going to this year. Yes, go out. Making concerted effort. Please, please, please. Um, What else is there? Yeah, but God damn. Did you see these uh, Hip Hop Award nominations for the BET Hip Hop Awards? Yeah, I'm appalled. You're appalled? (laughs) I'm not. not. Come with a hot take, Maul. No, I'm just, I didn't understand. Well, y'all let me know why the the money record was still up for single of the year. Because money. People are still spending money on it. Yeah. They spend money on it. And they're going to continue to. Uh, who is oh, now? Old Town Road won. Won what? Single of the year. It would have to. Yeah, how does it not? <laughs> it might not. It's the Hip Hop Awards. How? It's the Hip Hop Awards. Man, that shit better win. One of the biggest songs. What is it? The biggest. Who who got what nominations? Come on. Somebody give us some information about this shit. Let's all just <laughs> stop. There's an audience listening. Well, Album of the Year is always a big one. Uh, Travis Scott, Astro World, Meek Mill Championship, Lizzo, Cause I Love You, Khaled, Father of Azad, Tyler Creator, Igor, Dreamville, uh, Revenge of the Dreamers 3. Tyler might have my favorite album of the year, but I'm not putting that in the hip hop awards. It's not a hip hop album. Yeah, it's not. That's what I, that's what I, but that's how I feel Meek about Meek Mill would win that. And that well, Astro World, maybe. No, Astro World. Yeah. That's how I and feel I love about championships. all of these uh, nominations. It says, uh, it says, uh, Cardi has 10 nominations. Drake is third with seven. What else is here? What Fucking is Hot Ticket Performer? DJ Khaled, Travis it's Scott, J. Cole, <laughs> each nab eight nominations. Funkmaster Nip- Flex. Nipsey Hussle pulls away with a handful of nods, netting five nominations. And as for the newcomers, Meg, Meg the Stallion snags five, while the baby closes shop with four. Made this, you look this, best hip hop style. Joe Budden is not on here. This crazy. Um, this this sounds like they are trying to do something different with their nominations. This doesn't Definitely. sound like the Hip Hop Awards. Definitely. No, this well, what like they're the, trying to do sounds like the BET Awards. Yeah, they're trying to make it because we kill them every year because there's not many categories. Right. There's like, they give out four awards and play the ciphers. Yeah, and, we watch for the ciphers. <laughs> yeah, perform. So I, I think this is them trying to uh, make the make it an actual award show. Yeah, impact track. It's an interesting uh, and norm- category. And normally these award shows uh, leverage the nominations uh, in return for support. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm not certain. I mean, Car- maybe Cardi will be there. It's in Atlanta. She should be there. Uh, yeah. Offset, Offset, Migos. Yeah, cool. Meg, the baby. Yeah. Do we think Drake is going to the Hip Hop Awards? No. Probably not. No. I don't think that. No, no. He won't be there. We'll be watching. Is there anything more they can do with the ciphers this year? I feel like we've probably seen damn near everybody rap. <laughs> uh, no, I think with newer people. There's a bunch of newer people. There's right. actually some new kids that, like, I don't know if YBN. Cord- Cordae, Cordae would be great anything. in there. The baby would be great in there. The baby, yeah. Um, yeah, there's there's, there's, there's still some crews they could probably. A Dreamville cipher would be great. Yeah. Yeah, also I, that, I think also that might that, happen. Uh, Super Side No, that Earth Gang album is really dope. Yeah. Is it? I, I listened to it one time, but that wasn't. Probably in the space. But Somebody yeah, on yeah, Twitter yeah. keeps telling me to listen to that. It's good. Ta-da-da. But yeah, I would like Check a Dreamville out. cipher. Is there any other clicks? Right now, nah. That I would want to hear from. Well, maybe a TDE. I I don't know. Kendrick, kinda, hear it. Kendrick yeah. has kind of been like laying low. It would be kind of dope to see him in the cipher. Yeah, a female cipher would be kind of dope. I'm sure mm-hmm. they've done female, but there's new 
A lot of new females on the scene. That would be dope to see. They're yeah. not getting a TDE cipher. No, no they're not. No. They did one already. A Dreamville cipher makes a whole lot of sense, especially just with the year they've had. Uh, I can't wait to get January so I can uh, stand on my take of them just having probably the best year in hip hop. Yeah, really it's up there. Yeah. I wish I wish the VMAs and and just award shows in general would take this video director of the year seriously. <laughs> They've never taken it seriously. Not they put the same names in there even if they didn't do a video yeah. for the year. They do the same ones every time. There's amazing video directors, especially with everyone has a camera. Like I feel the same way about the hot ticket of the year award. I feel that way about the DJ shit. Uh, I love I that they have Chance B in here, but they always put the same DJs. Yeah, There's other DJs in the world. Yeah. What, what are you saying about the hot ticket uh, I don't award? know what the fuck that is. I have no clue. I like this lyricist. I like, of the year, but I like uh, that idea. Me too. I like the idea of Diversifying the categories, yeah. Just no word about how, who's hot, who's selling tickets, who's 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 a big time, yeah. Box office, yeah. Who's box office, yeah? Because I do think that 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 should be isolated. It shouldn't be uh, an attribute to why you win some of the other categories. But yeah. that but that category is a little misleading because hot ticket. When I when I hear hot, I, I would think Meg The Stallion's hot now. Obviously, she's not going to outsell the Carters and Drake and Travis Scott, but she's the hot ticket. She's she's, she's not right the now. she's not she the biggest hotter. ticket. She's hotter that she is hotter right now. Yeah. So I'm not sure what that, I'd be that curious category how is. Define that. Yeah, that's what I want to know. Yeah. She's hotter than who? She's the hot, hottest out of that thing. She's just not at, out selling Beyonce, Jay Z, Travis Scott. And she's Drake. hotter than everybody up there. <laughs> yeah. Hotter, yes. But that doesn't mean she's selling more, more tickets, tickets or at a higher. I agree. Yeah. 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 yeah, I agree. Hot is hot is more of the as a more as a moment in, a, in the moment, a moment thing, in yeah. the moment term. Travis Scott has eclipsed hot. The car the Carters have eclipsed, eclipsed hot. Yeah. Drake yeah. has eclipsed hot. Cardi B and the baby can still be in that in that hot realm, but Cardi's on her way. Cardi's to eclipsing on her that. way to eclipsing hot. And yeah. the baby and Meg have kind of been in a race all summer with the baby holding it down for the guys and Meg doing it for the women. Yeah. Oh. Best live performer. Oh, best, best live, live performer. performer. Oh, uh, Travis gonna have to take that, man. Yeah. What? Best I, live performer over over Beyonce, the Carters? It doesn't say Beyonce. It's it says the Carters. Carters. Okay, that show. That, that show is crazy. <laughs> like, come on, man. what are we Beyonce's talking about? Right Beyonce's in the Carters. She's a Carter. Yeah. Like, come yeah. on, man. What are we talking about? Okay, you made a point, but. This year, but why uh, are the actually, Carters in there? Get out of there! Because they just did the <laughs> I was going to say they shouldn't even be. They should like, be. That's, yeah. like, that's, that's Well, their crazy. album was last year. They're on the run. So this would have been fell in this year's. Barely. Yeah, but it's like uh, almost yeah, not yeah, fair. It's, it's not fair. They dick eating. Yeah, I guess that. I like it though. Album of the year: Astro World Championships. Because I love you, Father Beside, Igor, Revenge of the Dreamers Three. Um, I gotta go Astro World with that again because I don't consider Igor a rap album. Yeah, I would say I would agree. Or me, for me, it's Travis or 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 Dreamville for me. For yeah, me, Dreamville it will be are. Travis wins this, and if he doesn't, then Meek and Tyler can have a, a good fight for me. But Travis's album is better than all of those albums, like by far to me. Maybe yeah. not by far, not Meek, but Meek is not. Commercial enough to. You got to give that Tyler album another listen. That's a great album. Yeah, no, I just don't know if I no, consider no, it hip hop all the way. Why is it that? I figured you would like it more. I love it. Oh, you're just saying by far, and Meek Championships would be the next. I said I hold Meek and Tyler shit in the same regard. Okay, that's how that's big not what I heard it. That's 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 how big of a fan I am of. Uh, Championships. Actually, I probably don't hold them in the same regard because Igor is in my top five albums of the year so far. It's number one, championships for me. is not really. Igor is number one for me right now. But for, championships for years, is, is, is probably my favorite Meek album. Yeah, yeah, me too. I just I'm really big on that Travis Scott album. I am. It's a great album. I am. It's a really good album. I am. He, he did that. He did that. Uh, so I would expect him to win. Um, did Rory answer me last podcast when I asked no. him when was the last time that he <laughs> listened to that uh, drum record? With uh, her, you, you asked me that. No, I don't think you asked him. I meant to. Oh, okay, well, uh, I'm asking you now. I'll, I'll, Come on, keep it real. I, know, <laughs> I, I listen to it often. I, I walk back a uh, record of the year, but I listen to it often. Walk back record of the month. <laughs> <laughs> Still a great record. It just didn't didn't. 
I think if they would have said that though, I think we kind of said a record is that is that slow of a pace with that tempo. It's hard for it to, to sustain. Get momentum. They should have yeah. probably they should have probably came with it, something it gets after a, that. It gets a lot of burn in, in my home, but I should have probably that, that it sounds like an album in the world. Like that sounds uh, like cut. it's supposed to be part if of. You the find album. it on the album, be like, oh, this or it's is, yeah. the teaser for an album that's coming pretty soon. You know what I mean? Mm. I don't want to wait six months to hear the album that that's a part of now. I'm, I'm with you. Yeah. Yeah, you should hurry up now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's time. The countdown has started. Yeah. Wait, um, we also weren't invited to the Diamond Bowl? Yeah, Rihanna I've, don't fuck with I've us. I've never gone diamond. I've never worn a diamond. And <laughs> yes, she definitely doesn't fuck with us. <laughs> <laughs> All of those things are true. Great. I do want to be somewhere that Rihanna is. Me too. <laughs> Why? Same. Huh? She Why? seems like a fun person to be around. Rihanna seems like a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah she, she does. Is. She does. Excuse us, Ma. <laughs> yeah, our, 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 our bad. Never around. mind. Our bad, King. I haven't been around Rihanna like that. I'm just saying, she's she's a fun person. Hi, Rihanna. Hey. hey. Don't try to bite. <laughs> I'm just trying to like such suckers. Hi, Rihanna. Hey. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, I don't care. If I got to be a sucker for one. <laughs> yeah, for real. Let me That's see. That's the one. Do I value what Maul thinks or do I value what Rihanna thinks? <laughs> <laughs> tough, tough decision here. What are you going to do? Let me weigh it out. Oh, fuck. Huh. Um, is there anything else that we have to get to? It's a slow news week. It's a slow Saturday. Uh, I, I am currently in Atlanta or traveling to Atlanta for the Revolt Power Summit. I see oh, a lot dope. of people out there. There's a bunch of panels bunch of meet and greets, a bunch of celebrities talking to fans and just giving back to the community. I see Puff won an award. It's a lot of shit going on in Atlanta. Um, so I'll be out there, and if I'm awake enough, maybe I'll go to a party or two that night. Hey. Turn up. Oh, I know what that means. Turn up, then. That tricking. <laughs> it's good yeah. tricking out in Atlanta. Oh, couple couple bills get money get paid no, in Atlanta. No, no, that's a rule of mine, Parks. I don't like to spend 2500 in the same week twice. <laughs> like I already got I it off. Sense. I got it off this week. <laughs> are you are you in the Atlanta it, area? That's a nasty rule. Nah, because then it turns <laughs> into five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you can only do twenty five. <laughs> Yo, five no, five in a week, because then the next week you might get those same urges. Yeah. Now you've spent ten in two weeks. That's yeah. a lot. Sick. That's sick. It's a lot. Now you got dropping twenty in now a you, month. Now you yeah. have to go oh, another two crazy. weeks <laughs> without the urge to avoid getting the fucking forty. Some sick shit. <laughs> Do you think about that? Some sick that's math. Shit. No, no. I understand what you're saying, but I'm just saying just the thought of that is sick. Like, it's just like, why? Nah, yeah, you don't need the $2,500 special treat every day now and again. No, that's, you got to reserve that. <laughs> I can't one. believe y'all don't pay for pussy. <laughs> like honestly Fam, it's And not. I'm not saying I do. I'm just kicking it with y'all niggas. But it's just, <laughs> you know, for me, you know why? Because it's not that serious. All right, how about this? Fuck paying for pussy. I can't believe you don't pay for a girl to come through for an hour and do whatever you say. Nah. Yo, pick the carpet up. Pick the carpet up? Yeah. Yo, pick no, the, pick the carpet up. Yo, sweep. Sweep under, the, sweep under that carpet. I'll never get to that spot. It's called a maid. You he's a trying to get the bang bros, you get a dude. I see what he's doing. And do the same thing. I'm just saying. The, oh, the thrill and instruction. Trick you do it over FaceTime. Trick, don't lie. Trick, lie to me and tell me you don't try to instruct and be a director man over FaceTime. Lie to me. Director no, man. But that's what FaceTime is. Now you lie to me. Turn it to the side. <laughs> Turn, yo, Make the noise. Move the phone. Make that noise I like. Yeah. But that don't, I'm, not <laughs> I'm that guy. I'm not spending 2500 <laughs> to do that, though. Make no. <laughs> the noise is mad the same. <laughs> <laughs> Why does but why does that get it that done? That leads to my point. It's it's really not that serious. Yeah, it's the but same it, but shit. But in the moment, whoo, that's not twenty five hundred worth. No, whoo. I promise you, bro. Well, you're not paying twenty five hundred for her to make the noise over the Facetime ball. <laughs> no, no, I know you're not. I'm just saying, like in, you in know, person, though, you do know what the twenty five is. Do you for. get a full breakdown it's report? Yeah, like, you know what's was, funny that about twenty dollars. That was is lined up. Yeah, this, this is why I judge more. This is why I judge more. Seventy for the rug because the person that we was that we happened to mention off air when this conversation. Conversation came up is beautiful. What does that mean? He, you're giving that girl twenty five hundred. I promise you, nigga. No, <laughs> niggas is no, no. no some niggas, no, some no, niggas no, are. No, all the niggas some are. Niggas, no, some no, niggas all are. of us no, are. No, some <laughs> niggas are. No, all of us no, are. No, not all. Trust me. Tr- trust me. She easily this. getting seventeen a week. <laughs> no, for sure. It's a fucking truth. But it's a lot of dudes that's <laughs> not. God is for the twenty five. It's a lot of dudes that's not doing that though. <laughs> all that's right. all I'm saying. How, How much time do you rate? think she got? 
What do you mean? If she's getting 17 a week, how much extra time is she giving away the free? She's got to make a noise. Men, men pro have, bono. How much pro yo, bono listen, work is she men, doing? Men have, men have, Ball is crazy. men have <laughs> fucked up the market on pussy in so many ways. Men or pussy women? Is not, no, men no, or women? No, men. It's combined effort. Oh, no, 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 way, it's men. no way. Men no have, way. men have overpaid for pussy for years. Pussy does not cost that much. I can promise you that. Well, first of all, the market is the market. The market is what someone will pay. Exactly, which is what I said. Men, men have fucked it up. But it wasn't us. It was them Dubai niggas. No, it was men. It was men. <laughs> it was the Dubai. It men. was men. Is what I'm saying. Men, men have Pussy fucked us up. The Dubai Pussy does not cost that much. I promise you, it doesn't. The Dubai men was trying to do mad shit for twenty five hundred dollars. Shit on your face. Yeah. <laughs> Piss everywhere. Yeah, yeah. They was bugging, and the bitches came back over here looking at Joe different. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what I'm saying. Men fucked up the market. That's all. We just got to take accountability for it. Well, you shouldn't speak on the market because you won't get involved. I can still speak on it. But pay. No. It's crazy. <laughs> you I pay, pay for no pussy. Yeah, get, on, get on the trading Not floor. Pussy, pay for a good time. Pay for ambiance. Pay for the vibe. Oh, dinner? Yeah. All day. All right. Dinner, drinks, all day. Well, if Let's you're in the New it. York area and want some food, mall is available. No, 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 no. If you're in the Atlanta area and no. have a delinquent phone bill, if Joe is around. Listen, if, you're in, if you're in Atlanta this weekend, man, you trying a delinquent to delinquent phone bill. You trying to Joe's get twenty five hundred dollars richer. <laughs> Call the boy. Hit the god. Yeah. Uh, Drake the boy. Hit the god up. Hit the god. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, you know the god vibes. <laughs> this nigga's sick, man. This sick Yo, nigga. I'm put, I'm joking. I'm joking. No, somehow, no, somehow these little excerpts get back to sin. <laughs> Everyone relax. Somebody, I'm kidding. Somebody gonna screen record Joe his next encounter. Like I'm just saying, you want me to send it through now? <laughs> Now that one month, they're counting it in. Like, yo, what are these charges? Yeah. <laughs> like, exactly. There's a lot of them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Listen, man, it's just a wild month. There's Car a lot rental of them. service. <laughs> just a, just a Dry wild, cleaning. Just a wild month that month, man. <laughs> you know, Can I pay for pussy for you? No. Is that tricking? Yeah. It's a little weird. Wait, come he on. Tried. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. He tricked. I can't pay for pussy for you. No. Nah. Why? Joe, I don't like fucking, like, Prostitutes and escorts and whores. She's not a prostitute or escort or whore. If you're giving her money to fuck me, <laughs> that's, kind of, that's kind of the definition. <laughs> what the, the fuck are you talking about? But that's what I'm, he done lost all sight of what's what now. He just oh. running around. It's just like yo, here, 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 here. I know a bunch of girls that think mall is cute, so they go ahead and do what they do with mall, and then you tip them. <laughs> That's still pay it, Joe. What yeah, are you, you talking about? No, yo, you're crazy. Look how, you're crazy, look how I'm crazy. I'm crazy. Yo, man. Ball I had to back this yo, whole time. You know what Joe. it is? It's because I'm the single nigga no. in the room. Y'all just think I'm crazy. How do y'all show gratitude? Shit. What do you mean? Not with 2500 <laughs> maybe, maybe, a com- maybe a compliment. <laughs> you look nice today. Yo, the way you did that thing right there, the way you put your leg up right there, yo, that was mean. You need to come back like more and do Joe that. Joe going right to the 25. <laughs> yo, this nigga, yo, this nigga is. <laughs> yeah. You're beautiful, man. Uh, that's, yo, you're beautiful. Uh, cash yeah, app? That's already in the ca- ca- cash app. Got to double back and ask me, yo, you just sent this. Uh, <laughs> you just sent to, like, this exact number. Are you sure? Yes. Oh my You've doing your, it again. You've reached your limit for the day, sir. <laughs> she, she, she did it again. Oh, yeah, that sucks. When you hit the, the weekly limit on the cash the app. The trick limit? Like, damn, I gave you bitches 50. Oh, my <laughs> God. That's crazy. Joe. I'm kidding. <laughs> Yo, fam, it's a slow news week, and none of y'all will divulge anything to take this to the next level. So I'm just Wait, on so the I'm ledge by myself. Three hours of vulnerability. Wow, Joe, wow, really? To take it to the next no. level. Ma- Trick. Hey, Ma, try to turn it up. Joe, I don't fuck hoes, prostitutes, escorts. Yes, you do. The fuck are you talking? I'm trying to fucking make yourself look good at my expense. Yes, you do. I don't. I don't. Yes, you do. Just because just because you get it for free don't mean you don't. And First don't make don't. me... Joe is smarter than than he leads himself on to believe. This is just a commercial for him. <laughs> he gonna have every, every chicken. Yo, de- Yo heard you. Heard I you heard you that twenty five. I have personally walked escorts in the house to Maul's room, and I have not seen them till three days later. <laughs> So That's I don't Jesus know Christ. what I don't know what Were you Maul paying is talking hourly? about. Did you have a fridge in there? So Maul is definitely this fucking. This nigga's lying. Yeah, he had a fridge in there. He's lying. They yeah, have a fridge and a fireplace. Oh, <laughs> oh, fireplace for sure. Yeah. See oh, the, vibes. the vibes. The vibes. Yeah, that the vibes. Yeah. That's yeah. the vibes. Maul, Maul, Maul it's July. Yeah. What are you doing? It's not not fucking escorts because you're not paying Maul. That's what it is. That's where this this the distinction is in there for Maul. It's like, oh, you paid. Were they on the clock or off the clock? It's always on the clock if you fucking. I'm trying to think about what escorts I have fucked, honestly. 
No, we would like those with you. <laughs> Don't say you can say a name. I would never. You. <laughs> what you? Like, you know, like, you want? Uh, which to know? <laughs> How many? Which one? I, I honestly don't know. Right, let me serve you up a little bit. We will talk so they can't hear over the mic on what Joe is saying. No, nah, but that's not. That's <laughs> a- <laughs> But, that's, but I, we know Those each other. Do, though. That's that's different. That's different. Maul, I know different. all of mine. No, no, no. But she's different. That's <laughs> like, like I'm fly with her. She's no, different. No, no, no. no, 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 no come on, come on. Let me yell. Sleepers. Sleeper. Yo, we got this new segment, Sleepers. If that's we're gonna play a song that y'all are not hip to. That's the one. Who's the second one? Yo, you're doing this for real? No, you know why? <laughs> We're going to continue oh, to talk so we can not hear these names of what they're saying, <laughs> but they are whispering right now. And oh, Maul seems that. perplexed. Oh, God. I didn't know that. Yo, come I didn't on here, Maul. I didn't know that. But she... T- we Joe's been we, buying and, you and pussy we both, for years. And, and, and we both found out <laughs> what a good like, friend. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. And you know I didn't know that until months after that. Maul, my only statement is... But see, he's trying you to... Have you have done this. If I didn't know that... No, but if I, I didn't know... You can't say I You would have beat that thing down. That bitch was beautiful. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. I'm not saying this I was... This was a uh, goddess. No, no, I was not, mad. I'm not saying... I'm not, I'm not saying <laughs> I'm I was... Like, you know, fuck this nigga for free and I got 25. But that's what I'm saying. <laughs> that's why... But you gotta... So now you understand what I'm saying. Uh, I'm the hater for us. She was... <laughs> she was you in the no, background with the money? She was yeah. only... I thought it was... Hey. This room over here. Uh, I didn't know. I didn't know that girl from nowhere. I don't know what to do with. Hey, what are you doing? I didn't know that girl from anywhere. Boy, I'm stretching with money in my tired, boy. Yo, that, I didn't know her from anywhere. You see where my know. wallet was at? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> but that's different because I didn't. I, we, we didn't know her from Damn, anywhere. what's the section twenty five doing? Yo, what's it just Damn, laying? I, I think you're girl about, like, I low. knowingly know. Like, no, Mo, you don't have to knowingly know. Then you can't say I do. Uh, you can't say I fuck with escorts and strippers if I don't know. I mean, if you fuck escort. with escorts or strippers, you can say you fucked with escorts or strippers. I'm not saying you can't, but I didn't know. Yeah. Is what I'm saying. But that's what I'm saying excuse. about men. Rory, do you believe that you've ever in your life fucked someone who uh, has uh, been in that community? I know for a fact I have. Likewise. Have you paid for pussy? Not asking no. parts because we in his house. <laughs> and Rim's in his house. <laughs> More but Rim's in their house. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so we leave him out of his. Sit down, <laughs> sit down, and ah. Uh, now you sad in the kitchen. <laughs> Now you said yeah, that's all I'm saying about Maul. So no, I didn't know though. And Maul had that. some nice one. You had some of the finest escorts, nigga. No, I didn't know. <laughs> that's this that's girl. why I don't fuck with you. I didn't know these girls you were shame, escorts. You shame the community. I'm not. But sh- you had some. Why of the do you keep saying I'm shaming? I have that's not shamed stack. anybody. What you Come on, no one stack. Come on, man. Yo, but why you keep saying I, I haven't shamed you? <laughs> yeah, I haven't yeah. shamed you. We can rewind the tape. I didn't shame him. I Mad said shame. No, I was saying you can't try to say it's not tricking when it is. That's like, what I'm, I'm saying. I'm, I'm trying to end this to go trick. What the fuck? <laughs> like, I don't have and any that's all shame. I'm saying. That's I'm all saying. I'm saying. I'm not shaming you. Do your thing. I got twenty five hundred on reserve. <laughs> on reserve. You know what I'm saying? For real, because sometimes I freak it and go two weeks without spending. Ooh, Ooh see so you can double up. Ooh. That's a smart move. <laughs> I see you. Double pound, up. Pound me. <laughs> Hey, yo. <laughs> Shut up, Rory. I, I, I'm worth more than 25. Look at him all. He's what? texting her right now. Yeah. Yo, yo, how yo, could you not yo, tell me? Yo, shit got a little hot at the pod. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what you, that's what yo. you think I'll be. Yo, just yo. giving you a heads up. <laughs> no. Definitely not. Yo, I, I, want you, I wanted you to hear it from me. Shit heated up the fellas. <laughs> I don't do shit. Yeah, like that. I know. I don't do that. That's, um, that's not me. What else we got, man? Sleepers, man. <laughs> what we got? Uh, Only hey. Joe would fall asleep during the podcast. <laughs> no, I wasn't sleeping. I'm just chilling. I'm just listening. It's, it's cool. Five down. Yeah. Uh, rest in peace to half a meal. That was great. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Uh, and I think that is. I think that is a wrap. I think that is everything. Again, slow news week. Wasn't shit to talk. I'm so glad that Le'Veon Bell is all right. <laughs> I'm so glad that he's fine. I want to shout out to everybody else whose fantasy football team is dismal in week two. <laughs> <laughs> I put up 195 and lost last week, so. My teams are trash. They're really bad. My seasons are over. I went one and one. <laughs> week so one. I'm all right. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling optimistic. I'm one and one too, but man, we look bad. It's that part of the season where the week starts, and now you can put games to the names. It's my, <laughs> my, my team is just. They don't look the way you thought? <laughs> no. It's only week one. Yeah. Right. No, they're all injured now, too. Oh, <laughs> no, nah, that's different. Yeah, they're all. It's, it's, it's tough out there. Yeah. Um, is anything happening this weekend? Is there anything that we need to alert the people about? Anything going on out there? No. Just y'all, nah. in, just y'all in Dallas, me in Atlanta. Parks uh, yeah. in Buffalo. I'll be here. <laughs> I'll be in um I'll be at uh, Sony Hall 
for Monday for the Benny no, no, show. No, we're not shouting nothing out. Oh, sorry. Oh. oh, okay, the show, the show, the show. <laughs> yeah. Put, show, put show. me on the list, please, sir. Yeah. Oh, that show yeah. is Monday. Monday. Yeah, yeah, I'll, be there. I'll, I'll definitely be there. Monday. Uh, this weekend is indeed the Lights Out Festival. Uh, yeah. We heard it. I wanted I to attend. We been oh, there, yeah. shit. Yeah. Uh, she did DM me and say that there are tickets there for me if I want to go. Oh, I thought, I thought you were about to say. <laughs> <laughs> tickets, t- available. T- tickets are still available. <laughs> <laughs> no, that shit, been, that shit been sold out for a while. <laughs> but I, I went in her DMs, dick eating, begging for tickets, and she finally got back to me. So I appreciate it, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to go. Yeah, that's, that's a, a shame. It's a good show. It looks like it. Oh it's my, like a really good that show. Is the, oh, my Jesus, man. I'm so disappointed. Yeah. But if you are going out there, be safe. Have a blast. I'm sure you're about to witness an amazing concert with all of my favorite artists. Yeah. Uh, y'all be safe in Dallas, please. Don't do anything yeah. stupid. Well, stupider, because I know y'all going to act stupid. Of course. <laughs> uh, Parks, what you doing in Buffalo? Mixing? I'm, I'm going to be here. I'm going to be chilling. All right. Parks is Keep mixing in Buffalo. Gr- grilling, <laughs> just not for us. Yeah, he's grilling and getting ready for the winter. The winter grill. <laughs> nah, the winter grill hit different. That yeah, food yeah, be way better. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Um, until the next time, keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Uh, farewell. I bid you adieu. Adios. Arrivederci. So long. Goodbye. Ciao. <laughs> <laughs> you would try to get chow off. No, I'm bringing chow back. I'm, I'm bringing chow back. I'm chowing you niggas now. Right. Hey, yo. I ain't mad at what chow. What do you hey on? See, look. What do you hey on about chow? Chow was a good word. Oh, chow. Chow, chow was a good chow word. Chow and I'm eating niggas. Like, you're nasty. <laughs> I didn't say it You said it Rory's a nasty Irish man You, you, sa- you said it dad. Lad <laughs> Wait, what? You're a nasty lad <laughs> Yo, Did you know Peaky Blinders is back? What? Yeah When? Since when? Uh, a couple weeks ago Holy shit No yeah. I didn't know that Thank you Yeah I was just thinking about What I'm gonna watch Now that snowfall is off Yep It's only like six episodes But I yeah it's I, sh- I just need as much As I can to watch Yeah Peaky Blinders Great show Yeah Speaking of Irish lads Sorry I, I, I saw what you was doing. Yeah. I got it. My bad. We just had a moment, right? You don't know nothing I about that. Keep saying I What's your poem, bro? Hey, when you two niggas start liking each other and shit. <laughs> my peaky blinder brother right here. Um, listen, remember the girl is not. Oh, wait, that's not my poem. How's my poem start? Oh, there we go. Life is a series of moments and moments past, so let's make this one last. As and if there it's was all... justice, and now there's gas. There's gas. <laughs> there's gas. <laughs> let's make this one last as if it's all we have. Remember the girl is not cute. She's young. The girl's not thick. She's on her tippy toes. She doesn't have hips. She is sitting on the sink. She doesn't have a sense of humor. She grew up with brothers. She doesn't like you. She's just hungry. That's not woman's intuition. She went through your phone. (laughs) And last but not least, she is not protecting her peace. She is avoiding accountability, failing to realize how her actions have a negative effect on not only her life, but other lives as well. Yeah. I would just like to say it's very impressive that you remember that bullshit every week. Word. That's no, impressive. I did, I did think about that last week. I said, "Damn, I, I remember that shit. That must be like the only you mean it, the only semblance of rap." <laughs> of you mean he internalized yeah, that? Yeah. Uh, that wasn't like he didn't memorize it. <laughs> trying to have some real shit with y'all, but I can't. Yeah, fuck your real <laughs> shit. You mean that? Joke off. <laughs> no, you mean that. Ladies, remember, he's not an athlete. He's just tall. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't live with his mom It's the other way around He's, he's not, not at the stew <laughs> He's not balling He spent everything he had on those shoes He's not just really cool with your homegirl He's trying to set up the threesome Yeah <laughs> To right. chill He's not always at work He has a side apartment with the whole family staying there yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's your, his that's kids. your none the wiser Those are his too. kids not his, his, not his nieces and nephews Yeah he's not into kids Those yeah. are his kids Those are, <laughs> those are his kids yeah, that's his family. Yeah, yeah. yeah he, he's not rich, but he has a lot of rich friends. Yeah. We're going to keep adding to that nigga one. Yeah, it's not his car. No, we can nah, the guy, the, that that the dude, dude list one? is very long. Yeah, we're going to get, gonna get yeah. back to this dude one. Until the next time, man, everybody have a safe and blissful week and enjoy yourselves. And we'll talk to you all on Wednesday, man. We out of here. No, no, Joe Biden.